What's going on, crazy world? Welcome to another episode of the Black Sheep Perspective. I am so glad that my boy's finally back, man. Miami, give a huge motherfucking shout out to the oh, one and back. only Marcos, aka El Gawaiyo three hundred five. My boy, cheers. What it do, big dog? Welcome back, brother. Welcome I appreciate back. Appreciate you inviting me back. It's always great when we get to catch up, man. It's been a minute. I know we caught up about. When Chris was in town about like eight months ago, maybe. Eight? Was it more? It was more? I thought it was less. Jesus. No, it's at least. He, remember, he did the whole Columbia thing That's fucking crazy. back and forth already. Like, yeah. Fucking time. That's, that, that year flew, though. And he left in March. He's still, he's, he's still about that life. He's, deep, he's here right now, but he's, he's going back. That dude crown, bro. <laughs> That dude that I love I love that he likes to make moves, man. He's got it in him to drop his fucking balls and make some moves. Even if they backfire, because he's had some backfire. No, no, for sure. But I am talking about picking up and moving to Colombia. Right, making that move. Dude. But it but it made sense. He was spending almost three grand on his apartment to, sh- to live right over there by Dayland. That shit makes sense for anyone. Right, right. My my dude, like you fucking <clears throat> again. So a hundred thousand dollars over there, and you're living like a millionaire for a couple of years too. For, so if what you can get, for, in other words, your money's worth three times what it is exactly. over there, bro. Exactly. You can fucking whatever you use to live off of one year. Now you can live three. Exactly. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. And of course you can. And see. it's there's a beautiful mountains to hike. <laughs> You know? The bitches, the bitches. Papa. Papa. The most, the most, the most, the most, the 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 most banned guy, the most banned comedian on Instagram, and you're over here toning it down, calling women the hike. The hike you there for the mountains? <laughs> I love it. I love it. Nah, but yeah, yeah, it was it was a gangster move. Um, and he he had all the right intentions. And now he's back for a couple of months. I think he's gonna go. I think he's about to go back again. He's he's doing it right. He's my doing dog, it right. My dog caught all of them though. He caught he caught the clap, he caught the gonorrhea, he oh, caught the Lordy. Oh, wait. I'm glad we didn't say his last name. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I didn't know how many Chris's I know though. Yeah, I know, right? Oh, that's true, huh? We got a baseball Chris. Baseball Chris. Baseball Chris. Chris. Softball, softball, Chris. So, hey, hey, what's up with him? Wasn't he almost wifing up again? No, because he had that I just, bad I breakup, was, but then he got with somebody. I was just know. with him yesterday, bro. How's he I, doing? I, I, but me, me and him always have like these stages where I I'll disappear from him like six months. He gets starts getting too drunk and shit. But buddy's fucking good. He's uh. Hey, but you're you're a good disappearing act though. You are. Why? What you mean? You 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 do that. You ghost. But hold up, no. don't, no, don't. Not don't in a bad away. way. Not in a bad way. You you I, do, I you ghost. do your thing. I ghost, but I never ghosted you. I didn't say that. Damn, oh, okay. I didn't say that. Okay, okay. yeah, I definitely oh. ghost, motherfucker. <laughs> I Irish goodbye them in life. Oh my god, I'm, I was so known for Irish goodbyes. I had to fix that. Now people had to tell me, "Hey, Wes, you did another Irish goodbye." I was like, dude, I, was, I, get, I started yeah, spinning. Fuck that. I always and I wanted haul ass. I didn't want to talk to nobody. Too blasted. Yeah, I just made my way out the back door, dog. Yeah, fuck, before, before she get ugly. Yeah, and then, and then you gotta wait. What? Don't go, bro. Don't go. They fucking convince you. Stay another fucking 30, 45 minutes. Fuck all that. My boy, I, I know that you uh you cranking shit back up, man. I saw that you just performed um two weeks ago. Yes, sir. Uh, the fifteenth and the twenty second. So yeah, about two two weeks ago. <clears throat> and you, you you finally haven't been banned recently. God, you gotta buy. You got. You gotta buy by the fucking rules. Dog. Unfortunately, you know a big, a big when, part of your pocket of your I purse. Not abide by the rules. Oh, man. I don't know, My man. You, I guess you, I don't know. I thought maybe you said too much on Instagram, and that's why they kept fucking politics, bro. I got. I, got, I didn't. I didn't. Um, I never breached community guidelines. Like, sure. You think it was because you favored Republican shit? Talking about whatever? Trump. Trump. It was Trump, the Trump. Because listen, oh. I'm, I'm back now. Because I, I, what I've realized is that. They, I could talk all the shit I want. I could say whatever I want as long as I'm not promoting Trump. If I'm promoting Trump in a good in in a in a good light, mm. that's when they take it. That's uh, when they that's when they fucking want to cut your your because they don't want anyone pushing that dude. The, the, their whole fucking thing. I could bro. I, I I call Biden the fucking decrepit in chief all day. Like I shit on Biden, bro. Right. I, I start all my shows. Right, right. Fuck, Fuck Joe Biden! Biden. Right. I air that shit on fucking Instagram. So <clears throat> they don't give a fuck unless you're pushing uh, Trump. What they don't want to hear, basically. They don't want anyone to normalize him. That's that's their big problem. They don't want. And but are, are we? I mean, are we willing to go a little bit further and say that they're also leftists? 
they're left? Oh, no, of course. Social it's media, right the, 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 all, California, all, Hollywood, all, all that. All big tech is fucking so... Uh, left. Left. Liberals. Right. <clears throat> all right. of them, all of them. It doesn't matter. I mean, listen, they, they crown in that sense. Like, they run the entire fucking internet. Yeah. Right. The entire fucking internet. Every right. social media platform is run by another cuck soy boy. So... Bro, I, I tell you For what, For the man, exception you, of Twitter now. What, what, we got what, a fucking the man there. Something that I want to do, and yeah, we can talk about that too. That's how, that's obviously one of the topics. Um, bro, something that I want to do with you today, man. Obviously, we're going to have fun. We're going to cut up. We're going to talk some shit and blast. And, you know, I, I used to always tell people, you know, people, people, every time somebody, I come across somebody I haven't seen in a while, they always ask about you, though. Know, all yeah. the time. Yo, what's up with Kawaii, man? Are you still kicking on him? Like, yeah, man. I mean, we don't kick it. You know, he's doing his thing, but we keep in contact. We still, that's my boy. Da, da, nothing's You're ever busy changed. busy as fuck. And, well, I did. I got busy, and then I went through this transition. You see the new studio, you know, yeah. so that, that was a transitional phase as well. And, um, yeah, you know, I try to stay busy, man. But, you know, you know, we grind. We grind. We grind to do 100%. our thing. It ain't easy. We got to go out and get it. So, but regardless, people always asking about you. And, um, you know, I thought today, Dude, what better person? I want to talk about a 2022 recap. Let's talk about these fucking bullshit stories, crazy stories. Did you know? Did you hear this and that? And I tell people, me bro, Ka Kawaiyo's a fucking comedian, but that motherfucker is smart. And I tell people Appreciate all the time, I go, yo, he is intelligent. He studies. He researches shit. You're not going to just pass one quick one on him. He's going to know his shit. He's taught me a few things I didn't know. I'll never forget that you told me, uh, did you know that you, it's, it's a... You really can't multitask. And I was like, what do you mean? Yes, you can. You're like, no, like it's technically impossible. Yeah. Like, Kawaii, don't do this with me because I'm a multitasking <laughs> fucking king, okay? And sure enough, we looked it up and this and that, and I'm like, this motherfucker. Can't, can't. And then here I am hanging out with you. We getting high and shit. And what are we watching? Informative things and fucking nerdy shit. I'm like, okay, my boys. You know, it's you know. all baby shit, bro. I don't... I don't. You so know, so I I definitely love to hear your opinion on on a bunch of the crazy things that's gone on with it. It, with the world and all that. You just name one of the topics. So let's talk about that, man. What do you think the whole Elon Musk thing? Which by the way, it's not a hundred percent official, but because he still needs to receive one more little bit of something to the purchase goes through. From my understanding, correct no, me if I'm it, wrong. It is. It's a hundred percent. That's it. Uh, it is. That's it. So what do you think that's gonna do he, now? He, he fucking he took a <laughs> he's taking a fucking hit. Buddy, so this year, well, he, the real he's hit no he's longer taking, the richest guy. I know the real hit he took was in Tesla stock, but that was partly affected by the whole Twitter thing. What affected the Twitter, the the Tesla stock that bad, especially towards the, these last few months, because you know, obviously there's other reasons for the stock tanking. But but he lost two hundred billion. Billion, <laughs> but billion. I mean, B. I mean. Listen, it's it's okay to lose two hundred billion when you have five hundred. You got you It's still win. not okay, bro. But whatever, I hear you though. Yeah, I, I mean, again, it was in stock. Yeah. He could he could make that up. You got that, that could come back. But uh, bro, I think that that, that was that's been. Have you seen the shit but, but he's how, posting? Nah, have you seen I, the shit he's doing? Okay, nah, very little, bro. Very very little bro. because I, I'm I'm not a tweeter guy, so whatever. But me, but tell me this. I heard obviously his whole main ordeal. Is he wants to give true freedom of speech on that motherfucker? It doesn't matter what you say. There's no banning, ghost ban, none of that. Is that what he's? And he's kicking out people who something did something. So listen, I for I always had just to give you a little insight here. It's ironic. Twitter. I've had a Twitter since the Pepe Villeta days. That's how I got started in all this shit. I, okay. I met Pepe Villeta through Twitter. That's when Twitter was hot in Miami. Our scene doesn't really fucking doesn't fuck with Twitter like that. Mm. I've had an account since back then, like 10 years, and I never got banned because Twitter to me is my outlet to go talk shit. Like, bro, when I get pissed, I right. go look up somebody's Twitter. And I go, you fucking piece of shit, motherfucker. Oh, yeah. I never in my life got banned until Elon took over. <laughs> You just got banned? Yeah, on Twitter. Deleted my shit, dog. The irony, but here you want yes! it, but you wanted him to be in there. <laughs> yes! Yeah, hey, it is what it is. It is, right, right. It is what it is. So, But, but, but why do you think, though? What is it that you're oh, saying because, that, that he's not with, cool with? So, so the the main thing that these bitch-ass fucking liberals complain about, they, 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 they define freedom of speech as... A, they think that hate speech is not included in freedom of speech. And yes, it is. It is. It is. It is. It's a, come in. Get the fuck out of here. You got to be a moron to think that freedom of speech doesn't entail all fucking speech. Either way, 
since he took over and he left fucking Trump back on like a soldier, he, um, buddy, they were basically saying, oh, so what you're doing is just, all you're doing is promoting hate speech. So I guess he, he tried cracking down on like he, he's he's going he's trying to go the extra mile which goes to show you that he's he's trying to fucking appease all these motherfuckers these soy boys so i guess he's doubling down on the on the hate speech and yeah, they banned me cuz but, but i go in so i understood i fucking go in on twitter bro now with that said cuz you know I was, I was earlier i was referring to you being banned on instagram and i thought it was cuz you know you you fucked up some guidelines or whatever but now i see you know you reminded me that it wasn't because of that and it makes total sense well listen so are you are you wanting to do another to, to stay twitter on tw account to stay on twitter yeah nah and nah, i just made a fake one to talk shit also <laughs> but i just go there and talk shit that's just the not big okay it's to vent it's to vent and just to feel like uh, uh, uh imagine that they read it even if it was for a second that they fucking read my opinion but so th this is the deal with twitter bro Uh, you know, you know, since since I I came to this studio, I haven't smoked with nobody on the podcast yet. Oh, really? The first one, my boy. And by the way, again, like I tell you, people, if you ever make it to the podcast, what a great gesture! My boy did it the first time we ever did our first podcast, which was a couple years back. He came right back with it, Glenn Levis, twelve. Hell uh, yeah! Delicious bottle. Bring that whiskey if you're coming. Thank you, sir. So, um, fuck, where was I? Uh, to Twitter. You said fuck Twitter because it's not, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I was, I was gonna get at a point. Guys, that Elon Musk and what he's doing. Mm. Oh, 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 that's right. So, yeah, Elon Musk is. So, for example, one of the first things he did when he got in there is that he released. Uh, now that he's owner, he has access to all the shit that these people were doing before. He he leaked all the fucking files. Of showing how they how they uh they suppress right. stories, and it's fucking overwhelming, dog. And you can and listen. Every social media platform does exactly what Twitter was doing. Right. They, and they, bro, he leaked all the fucking information that they have. They could tell that politicians would reach out to them and tell them who to censor. Hey, shut them down. Hey, this one, the vaccines. They fucking. They censored everything that that was in in not in favor of the vaccines. Do it's you fun. think it's insane, bro? Do you, do you, yeah. Do you think somebody else would try to do the same with Instagram? Or is that even? It, or is that, is that not doable? It's absolutely no. That, that's what I just said. That every social media platform does. No, that. no, no. I'm saying, do you think somebody else will pull an Elon Musk on? They're not going to bother with Facebook. Zucker, Zucker, Zucker is, will never do it. So what's left? Zucker, Take TikTok, Zucker. right? I mean, because right now TikTok they're, they're saying China. They, you ain't buying that. I thought we already bought into that. Uh -oh. It's still them. See, this is how far off I'm on in this shit. Y'all learning right along with me, guys. Y'all learning right with me. I didn't, you know, I, I don't dig deep enough into this. Okay. Well, you, you know the whole gig, the whole. But thing are we, we trying have? to also ban it here in the states? Trump tried to ban it like a fucking gorilla. <laughs> he tried to ban it, and the reason being is TikTok's original. Purpose and this is documented. I'm not fucking uh, queuing on eating these fucking th conspiracies. <clears throat> um, TikTok's original purpose was to hack Americans w through their Wi Fi, mm. that was the plan. <clears throat> we figured that out. So now, Twitter well, they, said, they said, Fuck, we got caught and we can't use it for that. So, what do they do now? This, this article just dropped. So, if, if you go to China right now, and you jump on Twitter uh, on TikTok, which is called something else over there. If you jump on TikTok in China, all you see are educational videos, right? Uh, videos about you know people showing values, right? And family the, and values. the kids have a time to limit how much they can TikTok a day. Exactly. The algorithm in the United States is middle-aged women fucking dancing and doing voiceovers. Again, they're 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 so China China's they're they're trying to infiltrate our right our our way of thinking, bro. Which is it's fucking nutty. You know, at some point we gotta start talking about AI. Oh, we will. 
that shit is oh my god that shit's getting scary on next level shit yeah let's say that for later because that is literally next level shit right now oh, yeah, Yes, sir. No. Yeah, so so you you definitely think that <laughs> their whole their whole purpose was to infiltrate us in some shape <laughs> or form. Absolutely, anything anything that China does, China's never is it too successful? We're not we're not gonna be able to stop it now. I'll never stop it. I'll never stop that to talk. I mean, I, I don't. Know. It's your fucking choice to scroll past a fucking da- a middle aged woman dancing. Like, listen, one, one big thing I did in twenty twenty two was I stopped following thirst traps. Really, I start. Yeah, bro. I, and all I fucking and, and I make I focus on liking. The only shit that I like is shit that's informational. Shit that I want to congrats on to that. See. Yes, that's, that's what I do. Yeah, she was bummy. You fucking you go on there and it's just mindless fucking scrolling and thirsting and fucking. You get me? Yeah. So yeah, bro. And and, and in all honesty, it's it's kind of changed my fucking life because now I'm following people that have motivated me to fucking change, bro. Like uh, the diet I'm on, and I haven't lost my weight, but. It's because I haven't incorporated the working out property yet. But got had her off had her off like like two two three months ago. No, cheers to that, brother! Life, wow, bro. changed my fucking life, dog. Now I got a fucking routine again. You get what I'm saying? Had her had her off. I was always the. It never allowed me to settle into a. Fucking I was routine. you know I I, I want to keep it one hundred with the with the people you know listening and watching. Um, you know when I hit you up and I said you know hey we'd love to have you back on the podcast, homie. You know let's do this da da da. You said, all right, what were you thinking? What date? And I was like, bro, I was thinking, you know, for me, because of my schedule, my clients, I was like, let's do Tuesday night. That way we got time to have drinks, smoke, chill. We're going to rip 2022. And you go, bro, sorry, I I didn't. You said, "Uh, bro, um, you mind if we do the weekend, man? Because I'm really trying to commit to this. No drinking except on the weekends. And I'll, bro, that was and I, I hate to say this, but that was mind blowing to me because right. since I've known you, you know, you get it in, you know, and, and, and you and you function, you do it great. I know, I and, know. and I know that's a hard thing to cut. I, I have a drinking wine every night, every night. Problem. It's yeah. not a problem. It's a problem because it's not a problem. You feel me? So, so for you to say that, man, congrats on that, dude. Nah, yeah, man. I fuck. I'm really trying to. Uh, Is that for twenty three? You just started that. You trying to you know get that resolution? I, I've been doing it for the last three four months, but. Um, it's more about longevity, dog. I'm, I'm, I'm I, again. I'm seeing the finish line. <laughs> you are halfway you know, there. You halfway it. through the. Clip. I see it. So I'm, I'm trying to prolong it, bro. I'm you ain't, to, you haven't hit forty yet. Nah, I'm thirty seven. I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you, but 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 those bones are aching, <laughs> I, I, buddy. I'm, I'm burning the candle for both ends for a while now. Who was it that um? One of one of my people was posted in our group text. I think it was my boy Kevin. Shout out to my boy Kevin. Um, he posted this. Meme of um in the bed when we were young and you, and you saw kids you saw a kid just uh, it was a little video clip of the kid just diving in the bed and doing all crazy shit and it said when we were young and then it says in our thirties and it shows a motherfucker all taped uh, up and bandaged yo, yo. like it's like we can't even sleep the same anymore motherfucker, nowadays bro. motherfucker I'm wearing copper socks <laughs> oh my god to tone down this shit for real you the one you the first one I knew who had the um the U shaped pillow. Oh, oh, the pregnancy pillow. The, the, yeah, the yeah, hug, yeah, that whole yeah, hug. Yeah, I'm, I'm like, yeah. I saw it in your bedroom. I'm like, yo, homie, what the fuck is that? You're like, shit, you don't know about that? Truth, I'm like, is, are you spooning that? He's like, yeah. And I'm like, that's what I need, bro. How much is it? Like 300. Oh, hell no. I ain't <laughs> nah, paying that 300. Nah, 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 that bitch ain't 300. That, that, the, the whole, because I got that with a package. Bro, I had a pillow. It was, it was like a slanted pillow, memory foam and shit. But the pillow... Had a pocket so you could put your arm. Oh, my people's got that right now. So yeah. you don't fucking sleep on your and, shoulder. And yeah, make it go to sleep, right? That shit was pimping. So it was that and the pregnancy pillow was 300. The pregnancy pillow was like 120, 150. Bro, that's just the but, truth, bro. But, I go to sleep thinking, oh, that's my baby girl. Oh, shit. Real shit. I, I, um, more than anything, is just because I don't want to wake up hurting. Like, for me to fall asleep. I stopped sleeping with it because it fucked up my neck, by the way. Well, damn, that's crazy. My, my, Favorite position to go to sleep is on my belly with one leg. And listen, I look like a murder scene. Like I just got killed. Like I just jumped off a building. Bah, you know, like that. That's that's it right there. That's how I can fall asleep. But that's the worst for lower back pain because your hips your hips are sinking in, especially if you're long like myself and this and that. Uh, so I'm just trying to do the positions that <coughs> you don't hurt in, and it's supposed to be to the side. It's really supposed to be on your back I with a, with a on pillow on your. You you can do it though, and you can sleep throughout the whole well, night. So I've been uh, I have sleep apnea, 
So maybe, bro, and I'm telling you, that alone added 10 years to my life. I can tell you, guaranteed. Which part? Sleeping on your back? Getting, I got a CPAP. What is that? It's the the machine. It's you. You wear like a little nozzle oh, to help you breathe shit. because I have sleep. So sleep apnea is when you, you snore like a motherfucker. You can almost die with sleep apnea, right? You you can die if you if you're like on uh per, perkies. Oh, because perkies don't perkies block the the brain's signal to breathe. So you'll just fucking choke. When you say he's perky, guys. I, I believe he's talking Percocets. about Percocets. I mean, he's yeah, some, yeah, yeah. downer downer type pills. Opium, here. opium, and, and okay. any fucking opiates. The opiates fucking whatever signal the, the brain sends to, yo. <gasps> but, but yeah, so I fucking jumped on a CPAP machine. I mean, again, I'm a fat fuck. I got to lose a good 40 pounds, 50 pounds. But that's the reason I, I struggle with that fucking sleep apnea shit. Needless to say, I needed the fucking, bro. I was It, it was three years of getting terrible fucking sleep, sleep dog. Right, because you weren't breathing right. And Yeah, you're just not breathing properly or sufficiently, dog. And sleep. Is, is the most healthiest it's God. thing. Right. Sleep That's the is, most healthiest the, thing. Yeah. is the most crucial fucking thing in the world, bro. So the funny part is that, you know, if anybody hasn't hit their 30s yet, you learn all this shit, you know, when those 30s start kicking in and anybody listening in their 30s can attest to this. All the aches, the pains, the you're, you're getting up from bed a lot slower. You're doing stretches. You got to do little stretches. You're, you're walking in, in yeah. fucking, your range of motion increases as the day progresses. You, 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 you make it to the kitchen. You start doing some lunges before, man, before uh, I start uh, walking around. Like, it, it's 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 for real. And then it reminds you, damn, I'm only, I'm not even 40. I'm about to be 40. It's like, I only got half a life left. Uh, you uh, start you start looking at things differently, bro. You really do, man. Huh? You start seeing the finish line, you know? And you start realizing, oh shit, yo! If I don't, it's it's like an as existential thing. You start realizing, yo, if I don't, you know what, bongo I'm gonna be one of these fucking the value, hurting while, the while value 65, 70. Yeah, you're gonna hate it's the gonna next 10, 15 years of your horrible, last bit. Bro, yeah. Horrible. You, you, you're trying to make your last quarter of life. Yeah. Be a, a healthy. The golden years, you, bro. Like yeah, fucking, yeah. I mean, the golden years are when you're <laughs> being about. I want to make everything from this moment on fucking you know smooth. So. Back to the fucking, you know, think about Instagram and the people I'm following, man. I'm, you know, like I follow, I'm following this doctor. One of the major fucking things that I've done for like two, three months now is that I don't eat anything unless it's whole, like a whole food. Okay. Zero preservatives, like not even lunch meat, like ham and shit, none of that shit, because that shit has preservatives in it. Nothing, nothing, nothing in a box, nothing in a bag. And my dude, that, that's fucking life changing. That's been fucking the best part about everything. That and I've been getting root sun routinely. Like the second I wake up, vitamin D. I go out there, sit in the sun, I meditate a little bit. <sighs> Life changing, bro. Because I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. I I went, especially when I was living at that that apartment there by the zoo. Mm-hmm. Man, it was two three years that I really wouldn't. I avoided the sun because out of balance, out of even though you had that beautiful pool and the whole shebang, the cabana. Avoided the sun, bro, and now it's like a, I look forward to that shit, bro. It's, right. It's, 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 a, it's a weird thing that when you connect with the sun like that, and, and obviously it might be different for, for pale skin people, people who have light pigments and, and they're sensitive to it, but myself, I'm good. Yeah. Myself, like, same thing. I feel this weird, like, I'm absorbing energy. Like, now, I'm on some Thanos shit. That. Like, I now feel, I feel it, you know? Yeah. Now I feel that. I fucking I, 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 I'm done Because I swear to God I, I'll wake up Walk to the backyard I already know at what time and, and it's crazy Because you also When you start picking up On shit like that You realize how the sun Actually moves Right 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 And how the time changes Because Two months ago The The chair I have a chair In the, in the backyard there The sun Hits the chair by 9.30 So Two months later It's now by like 8.45 Mm. Because you know I'm waiting for the sun to come out, so I can just yeah, sit, yeah, boom, right there. Sit there, uh, and fucking meditate this shit, bro. I leave those sessions going, ooh, yeah, like I'm rolling balls, dog. <laughs> oh my god, <sighs> I can I can already see the next time you come back to the to the podcast, you're gonna be fucking spitting zodiacs on yeah. me, Wes. What I day were you born? Yeah, you gonna. <laughs> <laughs> oh my hey, but, uh, you, but yeah, you know what yeah, though? I don't listen. I don't give a fuck. I love to hear that, homie. I really do. I really do because you know it, it's 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 funny how we can tease and crack jokes, especially you as a comedian on, on people who who live that Zen life, people who really practice that yogi type 
you know, spiritually connected, holistic, eat fucking organic, all this bullshit. And we look at it like, oh, you get excited out. You know, that's us. But it, it, oh, no, it, it you life. realize that, yeah, man, there, there's there's a reason there. Yeah, and, and it makes a difference. It's it's quality, bro. It's quality of life. You're, you're the whole meditation thing. Just it, it's, it's consciousness, bro. And, when, and the more consciousness you have, the less likely you are to feed into the ego. And I think that's the most important fucking part about all that bullshit. Like the meditating, bro. Oh my God, dog. It's just, it's, and, and by the way, the crazy part about all, the ironic part about all of it is that it's always been my career that brings me back to the meditation because, bro, I'll, I'll fucking, you know, how, you see, my whole life, it's been always, you know, yo yoing. And I, I get focused, I get focused, and then pff, drift off. You get what I'm saying? Right. And it's always been. My show, for for example, you know, the last five years, my shows. When I get it, when I, it doesn't matter how many benders I go on, this and that. Five to seven days before my show, you tell me you go sober, straight sober, mm-hmm. knock everything out. I still smoke weed, but I don't do any other fucking thing, yeah. and I go back to meditating because, again, in order for me to rehearse and rehearse, and it's you need to be right all calm, there, bro. Yeah. You need to be fucking, you know, yeah. so. I always in order in order to get into that mood, I go, oh, shit. That's right. Gotta meditate. It, it's clockwork. And now that I've incorporated incorporated it as a daily part of my fucking routine, bro, life changing. My next step is to do it before going to sleep. Energy, focus, weight loss, recovery. All the things that you need to be able to live a very healthy and productive life. But what if we could be able to offer you all of these things in the comfort and convenience of your home? Flueless Mobile Wellness is the company that would be able to make all of those dreams come true. With enough energy and focus, all of your dreams will become a reality. We are here to serve. Anyhow, bro, so yeah, man, you know, to, to hear that you, you're you making those changes, man, I, I can't wait to see you. Uh, 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 that shit. Let me fill you up. No, I can't see. It's just gonna sound gay, but I can't wait to see you blossom in that direction. Another with all game that about shit. that, bro. Because I, um, I used to watch that show also. <laughs> oh, by the way, that's another thing that Whoa. people. That's another thing that people don't know about you. Like, you you, you got a lot of uh, like not romance, but. Like you'll cry for certain movies. You you yeah. got you you got hella emotion in you. Shit, I cried yeah. before coming here <laughs> through a commercial. <laughs> a commercial. And that shit happens frequently, dog. <laughs> but yeah, that's man, no, bro, 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 crying to me has always been a release. Like if you, if you think I'm a if you think I'm a fuck boy for crying, come and tell me something won't cry. Right, right. Come yeah. and tell me something won't cry. I dare you. Yeah. I have a I have fucking thrown the most blows. While crying, bro. <laughs> Mainly in my er, my real young years, but when I was a teen. Because it's cause those emotions that you can't fucking, like, fuck, you fucking took yeah, me uh, here. Z- exactly. You fucking brought me here to this place that I don't want, you know, I don't want to fucking be in. As a as an adult, I've never fucking cried while splitting somebody. But Let bro, me tell you something. Yeah, I'm, I'm all about showing your emotions. I had to check somebody at Tap 42 the other day, bro. Like, like. Literally, yeah, I got a video. Somebody took video, sent it to me on Instagram. Yo, I was there. You, you decked him? Bro, un borracho binga. Like, it's, bro, this dude, so he's like one of these fucking belligerent fucking drunks that he thinks that because he comes up to you that you have to address him or you have to talk to him. Hey, 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 well, I'll be at the bar at 1042 with my boy, and this dude comes, and I wasn't having it that day, bro. Because every now and then I entertain, and I don't want to look like a dickhead. Right, right. <clears throat> he goes, hey, go on. Yeah, bro, yeah. I kind of shrug him off. Takes the first time, Bob. He comes back later. Oh, he starts like it, and he, you know those fucking. But and then he'll start talking to my boy, and I'm, I'm like, yo, 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 good, good, bro. <laughs> Sees me later at the fucking at the bathroom, and he was like, oh, wow, okay, can not you, the bathroom scene. Jesus Christ! Hey, can you come into a stall with me, dog? Let's talk. I'm like, what the fuck you talking about stall, dog? That's prison time. Fuck! If I'm going in there to fight you, exactly. That's prison time. So get the fuck out of here, dog! And I, and I walk out. I go to the, back to the bar, sitting down. Uh, he happens to be the resident, but he go plug there <laughs> at the time forty two. Like that dude is just there, straight slanging all the time. But you you knew that at the time. 
Yeah, I oh, buy off of him. Oh, Lord. <laughs> shit, get the fuck out of here, dog. So, oh, so I fuck it. I, La Roda starts kicking in. Ah, look down the bar. Yo, yo, Tony. I do one of them things, right? Go to the bathroom. Serves me up. And buddy fucking goes, yo, but come, come talk to him. Come talk with me. In the, in the, cause it, basically, he wanted to talk about, yo, why you disrespecting me, dog? Like, oh, why, okay. why you fucking? Right. And I wasn't having that. Fuck you. Because you're a belligerent drunk and I'm not trying to fucking pay attention to you. Look, this is what you're here for. Right. Let me get the sack. <laughs> pa, go back to the bar. And this dude always told me, hey, look, for you, dog, give me 40. He would always tell me, right? <laughs> When we get back from this one, he goes, What's hey, the regular price? 50? 50, 50, 50. Oh, okay. 50. okay. Hey, we get back from this one, he goes, Hey, yo, 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 none of that 40 shit. Send me 50. <laughs> <laughs> you rightfully so, fuck it. Hey, so I sell him 45. Oh, my goodness, this guy. Yeah. He, he gets the fucking, he gets the nerve. He goes, He goes, Caballo, let's go outside, dog. Let's go outside. And I'm looking at this motherfucker like, He's really, he's, hey, really he's making the scene. Like, like this was yeah, noticeable by other, other people. Of course, he walks all the way to the front of Tap Forty Two. Oh, he got wild! Opening the door, let's go. What? And bro, the dude that I had invited to that day, bro, it was the first time we hung. And it sounds like it was on a fucking yeah, gay yeah, date. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, you have that right? No, but it was a bro. He's a fucking longtime friend, but it's I hadn't asked him to hang in fucking years. I look at him and I go, "Hey, Chris." Bro. Hey, look, another fucking Chris. And you know, Jesus you know, Christ. Th 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 Three already. Uh, hey, Chris. My bad, dog. This is not your fucking problem, yo. Give me a second. <laughs> and I go, yo, let's go to the back. I, I, I fucking, I'm familiar with the back of the top 42. And my buddy walks down the stairs, nigga. And I'm like, yeah. He fucking, he throws two, he, he throws two rights. And on the second one, I fucking catch his arm. And I catch the right side of his fucking shirt. Wow, I fucking I pancake him. And when I pancake him on a bench, it's on a bench is there. And the buddy's like 6'2. He he's a he's a if he if he had a set, he'd be a problem, but he's a <laughs> fuck boy. And bro, when I how he's there like that, I hold I'm holding down his arms, like I'm holding his arms and going, wow, and, and, and elbowing him. <laughs> so, so you're like mount you're full mounted on oh, him? Oh yeah, bro. But on the bench. Bro. Ah. <sighs> You literally have the video. I do, I do. Because somebody was recording it. A girl, a girl, a girl. A girl like, come they didn't put that shit on a, on a, um, only been, in day. I've been trying to get the Miami. fucking footage, bro, for the surveillance footage. Because I know them people out there, but they're trying to be, they're trying to, they're a little gay with it. So after two whack ass right punches, I have fucking, I have fucking buddy there, and then at the end I would slap him, going, "What's up now, you fucking idiot? What's up now?" I would slap him. And his girl, his girl had to climb on. That's his girl between us. The the, the one behind is the manager. And That's the, hilarious, bro. <laughs> fuck ass boy. It happens, man. I mean, shit. I I I've been at you with the at the bar for many 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 times. Where people people always come. They always want to be like you know. Come on, yo. Come the crazy part is that this wasn't a fan. It was, I mean, he is. He follows a dope dealer. Shit, but yeah, but he's just a fucking drunk fuck. Right. He's there every single Friday of his life and Saturday. Bro, if if I've had let's say a hypothetical number, two three thousand people come up to me, to the pigs, you say, if I've had three thousand people come up to me, three thousand of them have come with nothing but love. Right. Nobody has ever stepped to me, and right, not that it. I'm inviting, and I'm not fucking here. Oh yeah, because I'm so kind of hard ass. No, right, right, right. But everybody comes with nothing but love. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't see that they don't buy you shots right oh, here in front of me all the time. I get shots drunk for free all the time now, yeah. I get drunk for free all the fucking time now, dog. <laughs> well, it is what it is, man. You know, I mean, shit. It's not like anybody really got too out yeah, of hand. He, he, was, he was the one who jumped, you know, went too far with it. Least, but you listen, did try him with the 45. Every now You tried him with the 45. I don't give a fuck, yeah. yeah. But he went, he went too crazy with it, though. Yeah, bro. Hey, listen, I'm, I, I, <clears throat> I don't want to, but I will throw hands. <laughs> I don't want to. I ain't a killer, but don't push me, cousin. Like you know, all right. And I've been, and I've been, and I've been laced up too, bro. Right, right, right. Lost, yeah, yeah. I've lost fights. You get what I'm saying? Right, but right. I'm gonna throw hands. Right, the fuck out. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. That dude pushed me, bro. Cause listen, bro. I don't. I'm a grown ass man. <laughs> we listen, fighting out there. Listen, before we forget this, because 
I hate to do this because, man, I, I you know, I, I, if if I got a man crush on anybody, is this is I got probably a bunch the, of, I got a bunch of men crushes. This one, this I might one, as well be gay. Well, this one, <laughs> this is one of the few. So I want to talk about it, and then we're gonna run through these topics because I got a bunch of dope ass topics here I want to talk to you about about twenty twenty two. But since this one literally closed, and I didn't even put it on my list, since this topic literally closed out twenty two for us, let's let's start with that one, bro. What's up? My, we're, we're going way backwards. My dude, Dana White, man. What? Slapping his his wife in front of. All right, all right. No, 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 no. Think we out? Think we out? All right, all right. Shit back. We're, we're gonna see. Dial we're gonna see. Back. Right, hold on. I didn't say that she didn't hit him. I'm talking about the incident. The incident. No, 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 let's no, talk no, about no, the no, incident. Let's, let's talk. Let's. But before we talk about the incident, we have to clearly state what happened. Dana White was defending himself. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Okay. Dana so White was defending himself. Okay, I hear you, bro. So if we can start the conversation from that, if we can agree on that, then we can talk about this. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, I don't want to hear no shit about uh how he's gonna slap She slapped the fuck out of him and so, he slapped the fuck out of her. Alright, so what well, well, I would I would I would come back. He, would, he, he was feared so, to fearing for his life. I, I would come back with, and I hear you, because if we're gonna talk, you know, legalities. You're a better and, man than and, me. And, and, no, 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 it's I not that. A bitch. No, I hear you, homie. I, I hear never, you about that. Never, never unwarranted. I would never in my life put right, my hands on right. a woman that didn't attack, attack you me first. Right, right. So But and, I will slap a bitch. And, and and I will I will after I say what I feel about it, I'll I'll, I'll play the devil's advocate. You give me feedback and, and we'll move on. Because I think we're for the most part we're on the same page with it it's just uh you make it sound so much more you know merciless um thank you what i do feel is one that he was defending himself yes that number two under the influence of alcohol and i'm sure there was something probably else but if not if it was just alcohol it was alcohol when you take a hit from anybody and you're good you're past tipsy borderline drunk or drunk my goodness man i don't give a fuck who's in front of you you react, uh -huh. especially as not just a man, but a man who did boxing the majority of his life and has been surrounded by nothing but fights. Uh, so I, 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 that, that, that was a reaction. You're giving him too much credit. I think he slapped her because he got disrespected. And he wasn't going to be the guy. But if you're going to say that, then you can't go back on what you just said earlier, homie. You just said he defended himself. No, he didn't. He took that hit. And, and then the ego and the anger and everything kicked in. I was fucking he kidding. Went. He fucking slapped the bitch because she deserves to get fucking slapped. Oh, okay. See, that's different. Get the right. fuck out of here. You really thought I was going with the of self course defense? Not. Of course not. Of course not. She fucking disrespected him in, the, in a fucking room full of people. Right? Mm -hmm. And again, listen. Yeah, this is ego talking, but I don't give a fuck. Right. There's a certain code of conduct, bro. And yeah, he, it was a reactionary fucking. Right. How dare you, bitch? Right. How right. did, get the fuck out of here! You think Dana White was gonna leave that room smacked, right? Without having done something, right? Now, 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 get the fuck out now, of here. now, now, imagine this, right? Because no matter, no matter who's out there and wants to talk shit about what Kawhi is saying, and, and I agree with you to a great extent. Now, let's paint the other scenarios, right? Doesn't even have to be devil's advocate. Let's just paint the other scenarios. There's no devil's advocate there. No, no right? No, but I'm saying let's paint other it scenarios. Is what it is. Instead of slapping it, right? Let's say he grabbed her and just jacked her up, but he didn't fucking you know, he didn't hit her. That's right? worse. I think that's worse. Some might say, again, this, this is another scenario. People are still going to talk shit that even though he didn't hit her, he did that. He shouldn't have. All right. Let's go to all this, you know, soft ass people who are acting like a man is just supposed to get fucking attacked right, 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 and, right, right. and not react. Right. So Wait if for he, that one. Wait so for that one. If, if he takes that hit, blah, like he did, and doesn't do anything, just sits right there, doesn't do anything. One. He's the bitch. One. The cook. One. We know she's coming for a second one. We know that. Oh, we know she's coming uh, with a no, second number one. Number one, that's a great point. Two, now everybody's gonna say she runs it. He's a bitch. How can he's he be? The, how can he be the president of he's the fucking UFC? He's a cuck. A fight league. Bro, um, that was probably the most and then, and then, deserved no, fucking no, slap. Wait a minute, and then watch this. And then watch this. What if? Because I know there was like a security or whatever bodyguard. The same way I'm grabbing you right now. What if she goes for second slap or even in the first slap? If Buddy does this, is he in the wrong? Is that a battery? Because if Dana does that to her, it's uh, wrong. Yeah, yeah. Well, so you know online, what I mean? Like it's online, just, so it's crazy. Look, obviously, right away, the second that happened, Twitter, 
right away because that's where I like talking about shit. Oh, you did. <laughs> yeah, me Twitter, and, and, and I also I go to Twitter to see how how they're responding, how the left right. is coming right. out in situations. Right. I get you. Right, right, right. And so. So I fucking go over. I, I go to Twitter. All oh, the cucks, cuck central. Oh well, he was he was violently holding, aggressively holding her hands. Come on, motherfucker! You know that he was holding her hands to prevent the slap. That's. Do you think that's the first time she's ever slapped him? Do Do you? I I, I hate to say this, but no, I do not. Of course not. That that's, doesn't that doesn't come out of that like out of nowhere when you know listen, your face is on every camera. I can guarantee you, they beat the fuck out of each other. I can guarantee fucking to you. Right. And again, that's none of my fucking business. I'm not judging them for that, bro. Yeah, Everybody yeah, has yeah. their own fucking relationship. Listen, most of the but times, those type of scenarios, that's you're right. If that you're played right. out in public, that shit, triple it up. Triple it down fucking in, in private, bro. Get get there's, there's no there's no chance it doesn't happen in private. Now, you know, something that I don't like is is um and I get it because I know there's people out there who who, who like Oscar, but I wouldn't know is why why. Why who what? Why she slapped him? <laughs> that's what I want to fucking know. Right, that, 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 that's the juicy part. to be dirt. a bitch. Something yeah, something yeah. to be something with a bitch. There's no, no woman in her right mind would cause that kind of a fucking scene unless it was her, it, like her fight inner fiber. They got betrayed. And the only the only way you can be trained or she found out she's like not getting some kind of settlement. I don't know what the fuck. You, you, you never know when you when you're talking about the rich and and the famous man. Like they really have their own crazy world. And um, you got a point. You got a point. You, got a point. you know, it, it goes to show the whole, uh, you know, money can't buy you whatever happiness. We disagree to a great extent, but yeah, we understand that a lot of these rich people, man, they, they go through more shit than your average Joe because. Listen, the so, temptations so, are there, the money, the, the power, the, if, all, if all that stuff. Any of your listeners, if you don't already know, probably one of the dopest fucking shows. And and, and my boy was right about this. I think 30% of the likely, likeliness, likeliness, like, uh, you said it right, likeliness. No, likeness. Likeness, okay. Of the show is the opening song. But uh, have you have you ever watched Succession? No. Bro, Succession is an HBO show bad as fuck, bro. There's like three or four seasons out right now. It's It follows a billionaire family. A re- is this real? Docu-series? It's, no, it's not a real story. Okay, okay. It's, it's fiction. A, it's, yeah. Okay, okay. It's a, it's a, it's a sitcom. Okay. It's a, not a sitcom, a series. Series, gotcha. It follows the life, but but it's, it's dead on. And it follows the life of these billionaires. So this mogul, think of, and it, it kind of depicts... Rupert Mur- Murdoch, if I'm not mistaken, because the guy owns a media company. He's buku buku money, bro. And succession, the you know the, the word succession, what that means is who's gonna take over. And that's what the show is about. This old billionaire ass boss motherfucker. The whole show is basically this old man that's a billionaire that fucking did this all himself. And the drama of the and people the, who want to And the drama it. of his family, his right. kids, how they're trying to take yeah, it from him. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I it shows you. you how fucking miserable. Damn, Dana White's not there yet, but I hear you, though. That could be, no, that no, could no, be no, issues. No, 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 I've never you thought, that. you thought about it, though. Like, no, 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 you never this, know what's going on. This, Yeah, this is just a, a you know an added to, yeah, what, to what you said right, about right, okay, fucking I got you, I got you. money isn't. Yeah, yes, 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 yes. Billionaires. Are fucking miserable. There's yeah. billionaires out there that are miserable. Yeah, and the sons of those billionaires typically end up being more miserable. Right, right. It's, I would say the billionaire himself isn't the miserable. I tell you what, this, it's this, the, the children. There's a perfect segue into the next topic. Speaking of billionaires, how do you feel about the uh, when the queen died? Fuck that bitch. Quick like that, like nothing. Fuck huh? that bitch. I don't give a fuck. Shoot, my dude. Number one. Did, did, did you know because you know that everybody you, over there is happy, right? I was gonna say, see, you know, it's colonialism, you, 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 you bro. You know, you know so much more than I do on that tip, bro. I didn't even fuck know that so crackers. many people fucking gave shits about her. Fuck those, cra- yeah, exactly, bro. It's they don't give a shit about her. It's the illusion of the queen, right? right. Uh huh. Shut the. They're all fucking cousin fuckers. They're all fucking. Ins- they're they're. You understand that. They have in order to keep that bloodline. They had to do in, in, in order to keep the money. 
That's all. That's all that ever is about. The reason that people fucked each other, like the the the, the, the reason people committed incest always throughout the history of time is to keep money in the family. No, I'm not gonna go and give uh, half of my worth. That would be inaccurate with hillbillies, but okay. Well, you're absolutely right about that one. That was a low blow. Sorry. That's that's one branch of inc- <laughs> of incest <laughs> that does not apply to fucking. But I hear you. Though. I I get it. But I, throughout yeah. history, yeah. and especially them, the blue bloods, the royalty, they're all cousin fuckers. All those people are fucking gross. Look at look at it. Ugh. Let, on top let, of the let, fact that the, the racists as fuck, they're elite as fuck. No, no, let, let, let's stay on that family because there's there's another connection to straight bullshit on that. Markle? No, oh. Marco. Me no, Markle. The, the, the son who um who was involved with um, Epstein. Exactly. What do you think is going to happen with <laughs> What do you think is going to happen Nothing. with that? That's it. The worst Gone. is done. Just ladies already in prison. They're not leaking her files. That's what we need. We need someone to leak her files, to release those files. On who she told on, what she said. Everything, bro. Nobody's going to. By the way, it's going to be 50 years before those files. I might be dead by the time those files are released. Shit, there, uh, Joe Rogan was talking about um, you know, still, still, trying to get the, right? still trying to get the files for JFK. Uh, they haven't completely disclosed uh, all those not completely, files. completely, but th- 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 there's no. It, those files that they re- did release, confirmed. Confirmed what part? What that the CIA about? was in on it, guy. Oh, I didn't know that that was confirmed. Of course. The, the part that they left out was just like the, the name, number, and social securities. Damn. Okay. They could, it's confirmed the CIA was in on it. I didn't know no, that. Listen to me. If you remind me, if you're really that interested, okay. there's a three-hour documentary on YouTube. I saw this shit like seven years ago. Five, maybe four. <laughs> Three hour is <laughs> bro. It breaks down the JFK assassination to an nth degree, dog. There, undeniable. There was there was, undeniable. there was there was like five or six shooters. Right. There was like five or six shooters involved. Mm-hmm. And because because you, you I don't know if you remember the original the, the ricochet game. cannot happen through bones and all that for the it's magic such a clean bullet. this and yes hey, exactly listen, bro, hey, hey, listen this documentary okay every time I talk about it I get pissed because I want to go fucking like, damn I gotta fucking see this shit you haven't seen it no 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 I gotta go see it again oh okay bro they they have the day before the shooting. Oh, because JFK was never loved by by Congo. By he was his fellow man. So he got into presidency through the mafia. The mafia basically won the fucking election for him. They were the lobbyists. They made shit happen. Right. Exactly how exactly how the liberals are doing now in urban cities, where the, the fraud. I guarantee you that the fucking voting fraud is rampant. In fucking inner cities In urban cities That's the same thing That the mafia did In those days To get him elected It was ridiculous When he got into power The first thing he did Was make his fucking brother uh, Attorney general With the With the one goal To take down the mafia And they They eventually won Giuliani did But That was And so the mafia Hold up so this is, this is why there's also uh, theories or, or there's no theory. This is not a conspiracy. No, no, I'm saying that people were you know when th- those who don't want to believe that there was any actual proven facts of how who got why he got killed, they're saying I'm okay. They're saying that the, all the options are one Lee Harvey, two Russians, three Lee Harvey Cub- was a plant, three Cubans. Lee Harvey, well, Lee Harvey was one of the shooters, but he was also like a, a plant. Tell like me, a, plant, a fall guy, uh, whatever. The fall, right, exactly, yeah. the fall guy. Uh, Bro, Cubans were involved. They, one of the assassins was a Cuban, bro. Like, what, they had a Cuban sniper. Um, because this is the thing, bro. They 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 could not. They said, okay, if we're gonna do this. Do you remember the name of this movie, bro? It's very difficult to look up on. Like, I fuck. It's filtered out. I'll, I'll find it for you. Okay. Obviously, no, no, bro. I'm telling you. So they have wiretaps of uh. Lyndon B. Johnson was a vice president at that time. They have wiretaps of this dude at some governor's mansion in uh, I forget the the parade where he got killed was in Texas somewhere. 
I didn't know the details. Okay. He, they have taps on Linden, on that house where people were talking about the assassination that was going to happen. They knew it was going to happen. Yes, everybody, bro. I'm telling you, when, that's wow. When he got when he got voted into power, how many people do you think listening are are, are, are thinking that you're like some wild I'm a fucking conspirator. crazy nut? A hundred percent. But there's, a, there's no. But I'm asking. There's enough. If you there's if enough you there that to help the support that. Right? Right? Okay, okay, okay. You will okay. be. On my dark side of the moon. Okay. Oh, we're talking dark side of the moon now. Yeah. If you want to talk that, we can go there too. Okay. Okay. No, I, I feel you on that. All right. Cool. I know you're not just throwing some bullshit. Like I, like I said earlier, Bro, you're so a smart listen, motherfucker. They, they you provided, do your research. They provided a lot, a lot, a lot of evidence. You ever heard of the fucking man, the umbrella man? <laughs> what? <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> that one I'm looking up. How many man. of you guys have heard about the Umbrella Man? First of all, for some weird reason, the, J- the JFK assassination. I, I feel like I did hear about it, but now, now I think I'm making it up. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not J- too sure. JFK Umbrella. The Umbrella Man. Holy fuck. The Umbrella so, Man. So Umbrella Man. <laughs> Is, is, it, is, is he like Is he like uh, what, what was the movie Before you tell me uh, The Umbrella Man thing What was the movie Where their brothers got uh, They're like bulletproof uh, It's based in England uh, That group The uh, underground group They're like hitmen uh, They're not hitmen They're uh, Come on Her baby. Curve Is the one Angelina Jolie No No that was a, That was a different one um, It'll hit me It'll hit me Go ahead Tell me Alright Umbrella Man What's this about So Again The the assassination. The reason there was so many shooters, uh, 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 they hit them, they hit everybody with the. And again, it goes to show how they tried to cover it up. How ridiculous of a fucking response was! It was the magic bullet. It ricocheted five times and hit fucking three different people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They knew that they had to make it happen on this one try, and they that's why they hired like seven, five. It's like five to seven assassins. Not all of them took a shot. Right. Okay. They weren't all supposed to shoot, but the umbrella man was somebody that was fucking positioned on the sidewalk when the shooting happened, and his job was to hold up an umbrella if JFK wasn't dead. And if that umbrella was up, that's where the final shot came from the front. Because he, he goes, he goes, boof, he gets hit from the back, and he goes, boof, and then he gets hit from the front. You get what I'm saying? And so look, this is the, this is the fucking and did, but he never put it up because it all happened so quick. He was dead, right? So he, the umbrella was up. The umbrella was up. <laughs> That's on the sidewalk. The, the president's getting killed, and my my guy's like this holding an umbrella. There's no rain going on neither. <laughs> rain. It's Damn. rain on the parade, maybe. No, I'm saying there's no actual. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, wow, I didn't know that. I never heard about the umbrella man. Holy shit, dude! So, so that breaks it down. That documentary, you know, the grassy knoll. The grassy knoll, no. Gee, so you don't know nothing about the JFK. That, that's the most like that's the sold uh, theory that the shooter was from the grassy knoll, which is a grassy knoll is like a you know next like a, like you know, a little sliding up. Yeah, exactly. Patch, right. Yeah, exactly. That's that's the way they said the shooter was from. And this shit breaks it down. So the shoot, the last shooters, the dudes that were there to make sure this shit went down were a bunch of fucking jits. They, they were random. Uh, you know when you pull up to Home Depot and get two like, Mexicans? Wait, 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 shut the fuck up. <laughs> they, but they were white boys. Okay. But they were young motherfuckers that they hid in the sewer. Bro, and if you see the shots, bro, it's so fucking. You get fucking chills when you're watching that shit. So the kids were hiding in a sewer. Right, mm-hmm. you know the sewer and the, the sidewalk, the the one where it comes out. Yeah, of. yeah, yeah, the one you can slide up under. Yeah, yeah. It's there, and that's where that last shot came from. They go boof, and his head goes back. You hit it hard. You work out hard, but do you recover as hard as your exercises? Recovery is the number one thing that keeps most athletes from reaching the next level. Here at Flueless Mobile Wellness, we want to help you become the animal, the champion, the winner that you are. Recover right. Recover with Flueless Mobile Wellness. All right, I had to go take a piss, man. This, this alcohol caught up. This this good old Glean Nevis over here, right? That Kawaii's 
You're trying to take too much from Doug, me. Doug ain't editing no more? Nah, once again? No, 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 moved on for that, moved on for that. Who pussy ass niggas that in this shit, though? <laughs> Bitch <laughs> ass motherfucker. It's a, it's, it's a homie, it's a homie all the way in the Philippines. You, you better, in the Philippines. Oh! <laughs> so don't talk shit about you're my You're firing, dude. you're firing this shit? <laughs> Listen, anyway, I want to get back to this. So we were, we were talking about earlier about different topics <clears throat> and off cam, we mentioned AI and this is a huge topic and I think I don't want to put myself a, 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 on, a, on a higher pedestal than anybody else, but I think the majority of the world just does not realize the crazy amount of shit that's going on right now with AI software and and all the robotics and the softwares and the responses and well, the production of what they're doing. Well, well, what was crazy, and again, stay vigilant of the fucking topics, but what what's crazy is that I thought by now, I think that everybody thought by now that, for example, cashiers, regis people at registers. I thought I think that everyone thought that shit would be done by now. And what's crazy is that the AI that that's not the automation; it's fucking taking over. It's taking over on the quantum fucking computation side sh type of shit, where it's making. Calculations and 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 fucking um, it's coming to solutions for things that are much more serious. Like what? So they're they're gonna eliminate what kind of jobs? Engineers. So, so so again, the the biggest fear at first was oh my god automation. <coughs> Nobody the burger flipper is gone. Still not the case. <coughs> right. Plenty of burger flippers. Right. Cashiers. Oh my god, you're gonna have robotic tellers. And it's not to say that it's not gonna happen. But it hasn't happened. There, there, there's, I, I think what people didn't count, you know, put me, you know, take account for is that there's a certain value to human interaction. Of course. You get me? So, yeah. obviously, automation, because by the way, we have the technology that if auto, if, if cashiers could get substituted out, it would have happened already. The technology is, is, is well past is, that. Is, is, you're right. Isn't that isn't the easy answer to that? Correct me if I'm wrong. Isn't the easy answer to that is because we're still in a monetary system that is collecting cash? What would or, that, what or, would that have to do with anything? Why why do we need the cashiers then? Why haven't they eliminated them? Is I, it is, I is, think is it in order human to, interaction? To, human interaction, or to uh, continue, uh, continue providing certain jobs? I, I th so, oh, so you're telling me that McDonald's is doing the community a favor? In other words, you're telling me that McDonald's has cashiers because they're doing the community a favor and they want to employ people. Trust me that if so. You think once it's McDonald's doable, thought, they'll, they'll fire this, people. That's so, it. They'll make it all automated. So look, um, US One and Thirty Second Avenue. There's a McDonald's. You walk in there and there you get order your shit on a computer. You know what I'm saying? Right. Why isn't every McDonald's like that? Trust me that if it was profitable and it was working and it was something that McDonald's says, oh, shit, we just got to do this. I, I can almost guarantee you. So you think I think that, that they put the, they're there. losing money if they don't keep it more personal. Yes. That's what you think it is. I think that they they You so don't think words, these hungry, fat motherfuckers who love to go to, to McDonald's me. just go for the food. Listen to me. Come on, man. You act like they're having great conversations with fucking employees over there. You're underestimating how lonely people are. <laughs> Okay. You're, under, no, hey, you're underestimating the human experience. No, I'm not. I'm you're not. underestimating I, it. There's so, a lot of value there. And, and, and I look, agree with you. What I'm trying to tell you is that McDonald's on US 1 and 32nd, whatever the fuck it is, it's there, 32nd. If that McDonald's, so again, in my opinion, that was like a sample uh, project or a sample research. A guinea pig. Yeah, they said, let's put these fucking digital fucking mm -hmm. uh, registers right. out right. there. And if people start using that more, then there's no use for cashiers. Cashiers are still there. And no other McDonald's has fucking taken on the fucking trend. Meaning, and there's no, there's no, you know, definite answer, but for whatever reason, people obviously don't use the automated systems they want I, I think that there's 
a basic human desire. I, I agree with you, bro. I really, to, to I really interact do. interact with a person. I, I do, I do agree with you. And I, personally, I, I don't. I'm the motherfucker that yo, I don't want to deal with anyone's mistakes. But in all honesty, I can also see myself in ten years, or not even ten, anywhere as near as two or three years, right. realizing, holy shit, I miss people. So, so let, I miss I miss the human interaction. Let, let's, first of all, I think COVID definitely taught us that, but not you and I because we were out there wilding oh. out. <laughs> <laughs> fuck, we were like, fuck COVID. We were at every goddamn Flanagan's. Everybody who let us in. We were driving all the way to Broward and, and hitting up uh, Twin Peaks. <laughs> Shout out to Twin Peaks, man. Four. My goodness. Those motherfuckers opened up the doors before dude, us. Dude, one of the only ones, dude, straight up, man. But um, anyhow, I reference that all the time. Again, way, again, bro. those yeah. times, dude. I, those it is, so I miss you. Oh my boy, I miss you from those fucking times, bro. Dude, we, we were going hard, we, man. We, 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 we it's almost hard. like we cut cold turkey on the chilling. And, and don't get me wrong, I get it. Life started again, and I I, diff, I live I live a different lifestyle where you know. And plus, I was seeing I you. I was, see, I was seeing you a lot at poker, and then I fought, I had to pull back from the poker because my clients were yeah, early. Poker morning. was once a week. We were chilling every fucking day. Oh yeah, but how was quarantine? We were yeah. chilling every day. Yeah, we, were, we, were, we were like right. brothers. Yeah, yeah. So I, I I I I can uh, equate it, bro. I got because I got hurt, bro. Like I got hurt, and it wasn't your fault. But it's just like so. Um, online. I don't know. You, you never had a fucking online streak of playing video games and shit. Never, right? No, not online. No, yeah, so I, I was great at Street Fighter, but that's about it. In my teens, bro. In my teens, and even as my uh, as an adult now, I play PC games though. But in, back in the day, I was console. You okay. Know, Xbox, right, right, PlayStation. Right, right. Okay. I did PlayStation. I didn't know Xbox. Okay. You develop fucking friendships f with people that you never fucking see. <laughs> yeah, because you're talking to them and yeah. all. Yeah, and then yeah. one from one to the other, they disappear. And you fucking feel empty, <laughs> yo. I've, 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 I I hear you, I've bro. cried. I hear you. because I haven't heard from fucking uh, online friends. Mm -hmm. So and it's crazy because you, when you are online as much as I was in those days, you realize that people, you know, just like in real life, in physical, the physical you know, aspect, you build a defense. Like you, like I'm not gonna get hurt. I'm not gonna. It's almost like uh, you know in the movies how they depict. In the, when you're in the military That you don't want to <clears throat> Build a relationship with people Because right. you might lose them In fucking three exactly. hours Yeah, 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 yeah Gotcha, 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 gotcha That's how people Become online And that's why By the way uh, Online gaming Is where you will Most hear the word Nigger And I'm not I would never say that word Disrespectfully But It's where you hear Nigger the most why? I mean, are they just being racist? Because, fuck? Yeah, it's just a bunch of white motherfuckers that want to be able to say it. Oh, that's horrible. Bro. And but they so they go there to this place where no one's ever gonna tell them anything. Uh, kind of reminds me of keyboard gangsters type. Hundred percent. Yeah. Same exact concept. Same exact concept. <clears throat> so go and, and by the way, that's a great reminder. And they're all white. So that that's a goes, that was a great reminder of uh, what you mentioned in regards to how human interaction plays such a valuable role and you don't know it until it's not there anymore. So I I, I feel you on that when we're talking about the AI and, and continuing on with AI. Now, let's take it to another crazy level, right? You know, basically the AI and 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 I don't know if I'm saying this correctly, but the the most intelligent AIs, I don't know if one's more intelligent than others. It all depends on how much information they give it, right? And then it you know starts so it, it's all the it goes on its it, own. It, no, it's it's the computer. So um every computer uh, has but it's getting data that got which, by the way, put into it. If, if you if you go and do the research, and and very, by the way, it's very rudimentary just to un, to understand how a computer works. If you go look up the basics, bro, it's like I guarantee you'll understand it. Watching a five minute video three times, right? The computer is very, very, very much like the brain. Gotcha. Yeah, exactly. it has right. RAM, mm -hmm. like. Bro, our brain. I think they've. I don't even know how they fucking do that. From my understanding, when the computer when the computer was made, it was because the we designers have, were thinking about the brain. We have billions and trillions of gig gigabytes of RAM. Like RAM is right. memory. Right, right, right. Like we can store and store and store right, and right, store right. and store and store. Bro, I want to say I might be wrong. I think it's a trillion. At the very least, it's billions of gigs, which wow. is fucking nuts. Your biggest computer, super expensive, will hold 
So I have I have uh, 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 I have a boss ter- hog uh, computer. A few a few terabytes. In on, right? on a consumer level, consumer level like us, you know, obviously there's laptops, for example, you have the 30 racks. But on a consumer level, I have the top of the line, and I'm not bragging, I'm just, you know, I have the top of the line the laptop. That shit holds one terabyte, two terabytes, three terabytes. Four terabytes of natural, like organic fucking memory, and, uh, and a terabyte is is a thousand gigabytes? a thousand gigs, a dozen, a thousand gigs, a thousand. Okay, Jesus Christ, a thousand gigs. I remember back in the day, this is gonna make me sound old. Bubba, yes. A gigabyte was like ginormous, listen, ginormous. Listen, listen. <laughs> I remember. I can still remember walking into an app, Apple store, going, "Let me get the sixteen gigabyte." <laughs> No, not six. Well, that's even Giga, yes. megabytes before that. No, 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 not megabytes. Never megabytes. You crazy? There, there's pictures that are fucking sixty megabytes. Well, no, it's gigabytes. Before it hit it's a gig, gigs. Nah, there was gigs. something below a gig. What's below a gig? Megabyte. There was computers with megabytes and never a gig. Uh, no. Without a doubt, the first computers were all like a gig. Like so, but I'm telling you now. I'm sounding really old. You sound now. You sounding old like a motherfucker. Okay, but look. But, but this is the thing, though. So I'm, I'm being real with you. I was very blessed in elementary that I was put in gifted, blessed, and that gifted teacher was the most valuable teacher I've ever had in my life. And I, I, there was no gifted that gifted class. I did. I went for one hour, three days a week. And it was fucking. That woman took us. Three years running in elementary to fucking uh, Everglades to camp for a week. She was like one of those teachers, bro. That teacher, I have to. I, I love talking about this woman. Miss- isn't, isn't isn't that great that you would never think that somebody at such a young age had such an impact on you that you're talking about her right now, oh, man. almost in your forties? You, you like, no that, that's crazy. That, yeah, that's why yeah. great teachers, you know, they're so important they're, and they're so rare. Exactly. As bro, well, yeah. This woman, so. Again, it was a gifted class. She was in charge of just trying to bring out the critical thing. There was no curriculum. She made, she was in charge of her curriculum. To give you an example, this woman, we would walk into class. And again, it was like, going to fucking gifted class. We would walk, number one, we were the only kids in the city with Apple computers. There was other schools, but we were, I'm sorry, we were the only school, we were the only kids in the school that had access to Apple computers. I was playing with a mouse and keyboard when I was in third grade, bro. Mm-hmm. My, I knew how to, I knew how to, my way, my way around the keyboard. I'm sorry, a computer years before my parents were. They had fucking, like, I was, I understood right. the interface inside of fucking Apple. Either way, this woman, she had a reading bubble. And what a reading bubble is, is that she has this plastic bag that's maybe, I would say, 100 square feet. That is... 100 square feet? That's a big-ass bag, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, the size of this room. Holy shit. All right. right. It's connected. She had it connected professionally. It wasn't no, you know, rig. <laughs> uh to a fan and it would blow up when the fan was running and the whole time that bubble was open and what she would do is when we we, we would get to class throughout the class throughout the the period that you were there every 30 minutes uh, three different students would go inside the reading bubble and you go in there and it's like a sense it's, it's very similar it's like a very mild sensory de- deprivation. Right, I get it, right. Kind of close out all the noise, you know, well, send you, you out. Yeah. Reading and you are one, like, you, you know what, Doc? I might get that bobbing at the crib. Uh, that 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 is that's a that's a cool ass method. I've never heard something uh, like I'm that. I'm really I'm really glad. Listen, I'm I'm really glad that we went through this because I haven't. I, I bring that up every c- couple times a year, but right now is the first time that I've. Realized, holy shit, she was onto something. Look, exactly that, right. I, I never made the the did the math about the sensory depri- deprivation oh. aspect because that's what the fan and that's what made serves. you think about it, right? This fan served because I remember now. I literally remember going back there and I was, bro. You the reason you could concentrate because bro, reading, you 
have to yeah. learn to read. Exactly. Yeah. You have to learn to read because yeah. otherwise, you either you're not in, you're not uh, filtering mm. you're, or you're not interpreting it. What you're reading? Yeah, you're not absorbing you're not com it, comprehending you know, or, or or absorbing it. Right. Right. Uh, and uh, or you are only absorbing just little parts. Right. Which is I I, I, I love this this uh, term. I forgot who used it. I remember the podcast that I saw it on, but it was um. You got to know when to step on the ants. And what does it mean? All those little fucking thoughts that come out of uh, nowhere, uh -huh. getting this pussy, doing this drug, got to go uh, see a client, uh, got to uh, go uh, work uh, out. Just uh, oh, sh step on all those ants and stay focused. So, And it's difficult to zone in like that to, in order to get the most out of reading, as, as the example. And I love this method that you're talking about that she implemented. So That's just pretty dope. Oh, that's fucking... It's, it's just uh, like a buffer. It's a yeah, buffer. It's, no. a little, it's a little... Put okay, some ear moves on you and let's do it. Do it easier here. Do it easier. Right. So, fuck. What was I good? Well, I don't know. You mentioned that we were talking about AI and uh, no, 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 no. It was just on this fucking damn. That was a good one. <laughs> it was a good uh, one. It, it, was, was, it was. It was. It was more of something that I learned or something that I. Well, well it'll come back when it does. Yeah. When it cut. When it does, just just interrupt on a scary tip of AI, right? So AI is, is borderline. Uh, a psychic, right? Like if, if, if there if there's if you want to give anything enough credit to be like, all right, that's the closest we can get to a psychic. Right now, AI It's a predictor. Good, there you go. A predictor. Even better, thank you. It's a great predictor right now. Has everything else beat in this world in regards to predictions? Why? Because we gave it all the info that we had up from now to here. But this is and no, it's no, doing its thing. So so everything you said is right. The better way to look at it, the more uh, appreciative way to look at it is that we have built computers that can process enough information that these AIs have a fucking galaxy of information yeah, to exactly. base off. Right. So again, you know that's what that's what we were talking about before. How the brain, the the, the computer is very similar to the brain, the way it functions. Right. Right. Not very similar, but you know, offset. Um, no, it is it's very vaguely. Yes. It has the central processing system, right. and then it fucking it has different branches of shit. Um, <laughs> lost it again. Yeah, wait, wait, hold up. That's why I'm here. So, with the, with the facts that the, this this AI has taken so much information and is now, like you said, telling us about what our future is looking like. It's prediction. Exactly. So exactly. It's, now, that's, that's what I was saying. You, you, you've that, seen some of these predictions. The real, the real triumph here is the fact that we've built computers that can process so much information that now the AI is able to... Because, bro... All right, but that's a triumph. But fuck that. We're not trying to... We're not trying to get a reward for... This is what we got here. No, no. Now we're here. Now we're here. Yeah. What about what these AIs are saying? We're fucked. Like they, you're they fuck, you know? Well, 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 we you're talk fucked. About, so you're f hey, hang it up. I hang up the cleats. I, I, you're okay. fucked. So I saw. If you're not an athlete, if you're not an artist, if you're not look, sales, sales will forever motherfucking be available. Sales, you. It was the first job. It was the la it, it will be the last job. Sales. Every other fucking job. Again, and you'll see that human interaction will play into that. But they're gonna try to substitute another Everything. another way. So so now that you don't have to do all this, maybe maybe you can go be, do this. There'll be there'll be there'll be five major realty firms that offer human interaction. But for the most part, there's gonna be a box outside of a house showing you all the specs, all the pictures, all of this, okay, so all of that. So let's 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 you're gonna let's, be approved by the way, you're gonna be approved. Let's go. You let's, type in your information right there in the right. front of a house, you get approved. You can send the crib there. That's block. But but watch this, but watch this, Kawaii. But listen, you're still talking, in my opinion, from what the AIs have uh, predicted, you're still not going to the future, future, future. What are you talking about? AIs are predicting that we are gonna become all of us part of the system. You mean like nanobots? Like, not, not it, nanobots? It starts as nanobots, but then we become the system. In other words, 
very matrix like we are we no longer live as humans no more okay so, so we are literally so look, so look, computerized I will we're tell all you this that much. look we were talking it about predicted elon. it this isn't me hey, we were talking it about elon predicted it we were talking about elon Remember earlier we yeah, about yeah elon? earlier right as much as i love elon as much as i fuck with elon i will not put that fucking chip in my head the, right. the, the one that he's trying to yeah, make yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. look at least not the first two years. <laughs> <laughs> we're going we to see who falls victim to that yeah, shit first. Nah, I agree with to that. me, I'm going to treat it like the vaccine. Yeah, there you Boy, go. Boy, you go ahead, you do that. Did you ever get it? Hell no. I thought you didn't. Okay. As much as Never we were in out, my life. Yeah. In, yeah. My, in my fucking life, I'm a pure blood. Let's, let's 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 not get a let's not get this video banned off of YouTube. <laughs> hey man, listen, I haven't said nothing. Uh, By the way, I got, I got that blood too, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. All day, all day, See, listen, semen as well. Whoa, yeah, this, is me, this is me. Whoa, semen as well. Clean, hey, organic as the, fuck. Hold, Never nah, been tainted. Now I'm <laughs> nah, let them off that mess. The fucking Adderall. Yeah, yeah. 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 I wasn't free basing fucking crystals here. But so yeah, listen, hey, no, no, hold up. Oh uh, fuck. I was just getting that song here. You're horrible with this. You're fucking it up. It'll come back again. So w the reason I mentioned it is because th it was one of those AI art things. And somebody somebody did a time lapse of of what the AI developed. They and they, they input it. Remember the evolution of men. Exactly. It's exactly what it was. Yeah. And it took it all the way up until we became robotic. Well, well, well. And then the robotics were connected to... A bigger system, and then, and then before before you know, we all were right. we were all so in the system. All right, and let's that's discuss it. that. Do you want to lose weight? Do you want to have more focus? Are you looking to boost your immune system, or are you an athlete that is in pain and needs to recover to continue to crush your goals? Well, here at Flueless Mobile Wellness, we can help you out with every single one of those through the use of our vitamin infusions. Our preventative health services are as easy. As calling us up and we show up here at flueless mobile wellness your home is our office stay healthy with flueless okay but again on, on the ai tip uh, do you agree it's, it's scary that it's kind of trying to predict our future and our future is looking like we're going to be one with the matrix it said it on its own. So what's the matrix? You were talking about the matrix. I don't know. Right? I, I hate to say matrix. Find so the matrix. Weird. We can't Look, fucking talk like that. I guess. I guess. I feel like like okay. On like big parameters. We're, we're not real. Y your heart is digitalized. Like we're not real. Listen, I don't. No, 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 I don't no, no, buy no, 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 that's, that. that's not what the matrix is. That's not what the matrix is. The, the matrix. Well, then tell me, Neil. Listen, Tell me, listen, Neil. Mr. Smith. It's exactly. So, that's who the fuck I am. Go. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, this is CBD, right? Hell no. What the fuck? Oh, oh, sad. Sad. No, I'm just kidding. Hey, but even, uh, even in the Matrix, and I wasn't passing it, but it's fine. Right. I know. I'm still in gun. E even in the Matrix, so there's still physical bodies in the Matrix. It's real. There's still a physical. You still have to have an embryo. You have to have a starting point. There's, we're all, everybody still exists in the matrix. Now, what the matrix is, or the the theory or the concept, you know, and this is, I'm, I'm no professional, but you are plugged in. You have the natural embryo, but that embryo really, really never comes. The, the physical, it never comes into physical it never manifests physically. In other words, you're just an embryo that's plugged in to a network that provides you your that life. Is what, what that's is, what that's is what the life. matrix is. So and that's it's a format, it's a computer <laughs> program, it's coding. It's and, I, and I and I mentioned this off cam. So this is not comparable to the whole concept of like Sims, right? No, this is different. Sims is is you called it. It was called what? Um, NPC. So so what I was saying is that. I think that life is so there are certain there's certain ways that Sims is very comparable to life to real life because in the sense that there's a bunch of people just going through the motions right they, they are programmed right that's how we're comparable to Sims okay and by the way your your question was NPC that's like a non-player character that's AI like when you were playing a video and we, when you're in a video game and there's a, 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 a bot running around. So 
you know how you can play multiplayer where you you're online and you play against right. other real people. Yeah. If you added AI bots into that, that's what NPCs are. When you're doing the the campaign version of a video game, all the people in there those are NPCs. Those are non-player characters. They don't have their own consciousness. So on, on the consciousness tip, you feel like that's is probably what separates you from from totally buying in on the thought that if we were a simulation or if we would ever get there because you you were alluding to the whole interaction there's human a, human interaction there's a lot of evidence that we are a simulation by the way you do think that but but there's deep a, but deep down but, but, there's not okay, a but lot look, of evidence look, there's there's but, but, but deep down but deep down inside on some on some real quick answer do you believe that we are in a simulation this no, motherfucker no. has to think about it. No, no I, I, I don't. But but the, the possibility is to get there, bro. Do you understand? We'll get there. Do you think? So, but we're not so, there. So do you remember what we were talking about earlier? <clears throat> Where we agreed, regardless of what you think God is, right? Mm -hmm. The ant farm. Whether we're an ant farm or not, whatever, however you look at it, if you believe in God, whatever God you believe in. He, he's that version of the end farm owner, right? Right. We agree that there's an end farm owner out there, right? Yes. Someone controlling this, everything that we're going through. No, so no, don't say it like that. Not someone. I, I want to sign out. No, well, you said someone controlling. No, someone who started it, who created it, it, who created it, and and might be overlooking it. Yes. Okay. Because I don't want to. So I don't want to. The person that created this isn't manipulating it. No. Nope. That that part no I because can, I can agree with that because because if we go back to the ant farm agree, I can agree with that I can agree with that I don't think I don't think that person Some, is manipulating right somebody who does somebody who does well, an ant farm until, if, 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 hey, if, hold, if on, I, hold on hold on hold on hold on God actually not, my bad but we're talking about whoever the fucking god is manipulating shit so you're gonna tell me when in in like the three because you know we can track when the levels of extinction. Happened right? Like there were a, there were apocalypses on Earth. You know that, right? And there's still a lot more information so coming you, up. So, so I'm think, not sold on anything. You, you don't think that the ant farm owner was the one that said, "Yo, hold up, this shit ain't going." Hold up. <laughs> okay, so I so put a meteor. Per, person, or personally, yeah, personally, I do not. I do not. I do not. And and it, here's 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 my little funny comical response to that. Right? I'm sure that a bunch of us, please guys, if you think differently, comment comment on the on the, below the video. How many ant farmers have you known or people who own some type of, of cultivated scenario? Could be some uh, bearded dragons, could be some uh, fish tank, whatever, whatever. You know, somebody who likes that type of shit, right? They become the ant farmer. They become the god. They become, I don't like to say god. They become the creator, right? The governing whatever body, entity. How many of those people became sick fucks and like to just out of nowhere put some crazy turbulence into it. Like, who would put a whirlpool into a fucking fish tank? Who would go into an ant farm with a with a tree branch and just fucking stir that shit up and just cause all kind of uproar? Who would do that? What 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 sick what sick person have you known who so did that? that? That's kind of that's kind of where I was going. So if there is an overseeing creator, this, 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 I don't think that they have any part in stirring you, you shit up. You answer that? Once I was done. Oh, I just finished. I'm gonna take a hit. Go ahead. I wasn't done, motherfucker. Go. So I was saying, like, again, this ant farm owner. What is to stop him from fucking doing something? And and I think again, if I own an ant farm and the ant farm is working efficiently on its own, right? I'm gonna leave it alone. No. Right. Because that's literally that's how we're putting it. Our world, Marco, Marco, we look, are in look, an ant farm. But look, so well, if up. you have if you have an ant farm and the ant farm is working efficiently on its own, mm -hmm. are you gonna are you gonna be the piece of shit that disrupts that and fucks it up? <clears throat> okay, so the, the, now, but now, so if you ask me a question, I can't. Answer. But hold up, I haven't finished either, bitch. The two part question. Hey, yeah. But isn't it that if that same ant farm, if the same ants that were running efficiently, okay. Started turning on each other and became rabid, and they became fucking, let's say, car, uh, right, right, right. Can cannibalish. Right. 
I'm ready. Would you not fucking fuck up the ant farm to start it all over again? So my my ins- my instinctive easy response, and I think it's the most logical answer that everybody would think is no, because you're an observer. These people who create these scenarios, they're observers. They're like field biologists. They go out there into the field. You talking they, about God? They they observe. Listen. Talk about God. The creator, if that's what we're talking about. Yes, as a, as a creator. Here's okay. God. So so remember this, Here's right? God. You don't agree? Think about this, right? If 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 we're talking about conceptually speaking, what do I believe is possible? Not what do I believe happened? Could there be a, a creator? I don't want to say a God, but could there be a creator? Yes. If I believe in that, if I entertain that creator concept, yeah, but you, you, you I believe, look if at you it, believe in God, you believe in a creator. Okay, bro. You want to you want to put titles? Okay, so if we're fucking, no, if we're fucking, we're, we're dating. If we're fucking, hold we're dating. Hold on, hold on, that's hold it. On, You're my on. man. But yeah, yo. But hold on. It's yes. the same shit. Yes. No, it's not. Yo, if we're having discussions. If we're having normal or reasonable discussions, in any real discussion, there has to be a basis. Very simple. Otherwise, what the fuck are we talking about? Creator is God to you, is it not? And God is a fucking... The, the, yo, don't take that lightly. No, because here's the thing. When I think God, and, and if we had to look it up... You know, we could do it. Fuck looking I mean, it up. What is God to you? What I'm is saying, God to you? I think when, when you when you put that label as a God, you're talking about an entity who is understanding, communicating. Has no, some not ty- communicating. Has how some you, of, how's, how's your God communicating? So, you? okay. So if you look up the, the, and I can't quote this, like I don't want it to, to backfire on me. If you look up a God, I'm pretty sure one of the definitions is some something with a, an entity with a superpowers. So... I'm not. I'm not. I'm not thinking on that scale, and that was just one of the definitions. Oh, so, all right. So, so if that's the case, then I'm not. I'm not referring to the definition of God in the Webster's dictionary. Okay, so I'm asking you, what a creator is a God is what you're thinking. Okay, fine. That, that, that doesn't bug me. It doesn't you. bug me. Yeah, that, that can be a God. Yeah. So there's a God. It's a God. If, so if He created us, that's our God. Cool. So I'm gonna flow with that. That's fine. But when I entertain that concept. I see that possibility, me personally, I see that possibility as, because I connect to it, as, I'm, I'm done with that, as, imagine a lab full of chemists mm-hmm. who are just fucking mixing their shit and their- Experimenting. Experimenting. Mm-hmm. What about it? I can see that, and I can see that our experimenter, our God- So that's what you think he's doing, he's experimenting? No, he ain't doing shit, he just did it once. If I'm gonna entertain that concept, so I, I listen, so by the way, I, but but you follow me on that, right? I, if I, I entertain the but concept, I agree with. So, like I was telling you, this deep has ever gone about this so kind of talk. This so is no, no, but let's stick to the ant farm because that's a great fucking analogy. Again, if you have an ant farm and that ant farm is working at the economy, the ant the ant economy is working sufficiently. You're not gonna touch that, right? Depends on what my intentions were when I started that ant farm. You have to agree with that if you give. It I would. I, well, I would. I would imagine that anybody who's starting anything starts it with the intention of it succeeding. Observe, no, no. Kawaii. They want to. They want to observe. They want to observe. They were being curious. So okay. So so listen. They, 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 by the but, way, that's but, a, that's a great possibility. But then, what type of but God are you talking listen, about? Listen, but that's a great possibility. That's a great possibility. But it, it still leads back to exactly what I was talking about because what I was getting at is that the only time you would rattle an ant farm that was efficiently working is if that ant farm turned on itself the same point to what you just said if it maybe our god or the creator said fuck it i'm done with this version i don't want to entertain dinosaurs anymore put a comet start a fucking a whole different and by the way you know we we were if i'm not mistaken we were created from water and we developed you're talking about the evolution theory. Yeah, well, I mean, after so we weren't around when din- as far as I know, we weren't around when dinosaurs were around. Not not Homo sapiens, no. Yeah. So when when dinosaurs went extinct, there was a period, and then we came about. What are you throwing at me, bro? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. It, 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 so it, the reason I bring up the dinosaurs is because again, we're talking about the ant farm, right? And when God said, "Yo." 
Okay, so I don't so, like these ants. So, so, so which are the dinosaurs. So let let, let, let let me try to zoom. Let me try to zoom your. I'm trying to understand your belief because I don't want you to be so on the fence or like my brother loves to do. Bitch, Dan, not, Dan, Dan, Danny, I love you. About nothing, bitch. Um, my I'm not on the fence about nothing. My brother likes to do you know devil's advocate shit. You like to do devil's what advocate. What is your belief then? As far as what? Do you believe there is a God? I and believe he, there's he, God. Okay. So, does so, he so, does he answer prayers? So, does he intervene into our lives? No. No, he's no, got nothing to do with no, it. No, no, no. He just so, hears us, sees so, us, and he sits so, back and no, 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 watches. I'm glad you brought it up. I'm glad you brought it up. Thank you. God, to me, there's there's different versions because of how people interpret things. I want yours, bro. Okay, so to me, God is us. We're God. Everything about us. If I love you, the feeling I get, because again, these are emotions that whoever created us created these emotions. Oh, I can't go for that. See, we're gonna have to change the topic because I'm being real with you. If you if so, you just so entertain what? evolution, you entertain evolution, but now you're saying that God put these emotions in us when it was evolution that brought us from here no, with no emotions no, no, no. to a whole developed species with emotions. What the fuck does it have to do with anything? How the hell did God intervene he, in, in that? The potential. He the, when he created whatever we whatever we evolved from. He put that in there originally with the intention of it evolving to what it evolved. To. Okay, so do you do believe in? Okay, so let, let, let's go through some quick easy to steps. Me God and is, then, and we you won't know, to go. me, God is how we feel. It's, to me, God is an, we are a network of people. So all of our brains, your consciousness, you know, your so. Okay, but hold on. Before before you go that, let, let me interrupt you. Go to sleep, you, you know, you're gone. Okay, I, you're I dead. get that. I get that. Look, sleep is as good as dead. You're you're disconnected. Marcos, with all, when you're with, awake, with all due respect, let me, let me cut in real quick. With all due respect, right? Because I I want to tr try to cover these bases so that you know so we can skip the in between part, right? Okay. Do you do believe God intervenes in no. our in our in our life thing? No, no not at all. Right. Okay, so. When Big Bang, when, I don't believe in the immaculate conception. When, when, when Big Bang shit happened, did God have something to do with that? That's something that's debatable because okay, okay. that's outside of our fucking sphere. Okay, so but here in the natural world, in the in the world that our God created, so okay, there's there's but are there's you are physics, you so, so, so are you are you partially separating that God has something to do with our planet and our galaxy, but not the uh, rest of the universe? Uh, uh, or did he create the universe and started that whole Big Bang concept? But this is, again, it goes back back to what I told you earlier. Every that God that God that you're referring to right now, hypothetically, let's say I believed in him or that you believed in him. What created that God? So that's what I'm telling you. It's like a never ending. I get it's that. It's a perpetual yeah. of you just have to believe. And by the way, it's probably you, you, you don't have the, to. It's believe. the only thing I believe in. Because by the way, I you know I, I and I make fun of this all the time on Instagram. Now I made it a part of my set in my comedy show. What, what part? That I think that Virgin the Virgin Mary is a major hypocrisy. Like get the fuck out of here! You really believe in the Immaculate Conception? You think she she was holding it out and got knocked? Papa, that's un tarro. <laughs> that's un tarro. All right, so that's listen. she's the most overlooked hoe in history. Oh my goodness Listen yo, yo hold up And by the way This is exactly what I said At my show Because everybody By the way here in Miami They all The Cubans All the other Hispanics No Con, con la Virgen Maria No se puede Get the fuck So what I asked I go You know I said I, I brought that up And I'm, I'm changing that joke But either way It still stands what woman in the fucking crowd I asked What woman here Can tell me right now That that story Flies at home You come home And, and, and obviously This is part of my joke I was like right. You come home you're, How about if your wife You buddy in the, in, the, in, the, in the crowd How about if your wife Comes home six months from now And says Right And she's like hey And you look over there For the first time In a few months And you realize Yo all that extra weight wasn't right. that she was throwing back a bunch of Joe's Rock and Rib Rolls. Right, 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 right. But instead, she's in her fucking third trimester. And you know, it's not yours because you haven't fucked her in fucking All right, those so long. You're going to tell me that your, your girl comes up to you with that fucking cuento ese, you're going to believe it? Of course not, and I don't know you want to think. Joseph is un tarru. But yeah, exactly. But back in those times, you would think that. 
Now, but listen, the Bible would have you believe that virgin, of course, the virgin Mary right. had committed a sin. So, so you know listen, that, right? This, yeah, man, I'm man, I'm not biblical, so I, I really, I, but you understand that. Yes, of course. I know. It's all fucking she, that's shit. why she was pure enough to fucking give birth to fucking Christ. Yeah. I did I don't even like to talk about that dumb shit, right? Because I don't want to I don't I don't Mina. Listen, listen, listen. I don't Oy. Oy. I didn't even know. I thought it was just a fool. I thought it was just full from last night. Apparently they fucking asked her if you're down for this and she's like, Yeah, I am. Exactly. They're like, so hey, do I want to plant that? Listen. And, 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 so what about what about the concept? Yeah, by the way, my I, joke in my joke, I go, I'm sorry. Go, go, go! No, just my joke, but that joke was so good. It was so good because I I wrote it knowing that, that everybody was gonna hate it. Of course, that was one of the few times I've ever gone through a whole part of my like a bit and no laugh. There were laughs, the 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 hand it out, but for the most part, which is what I wanted. Everybody was like, "What the fuck? How dare you? Yeah, and 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 my whole fucking thing is like, you know, you, you, like so. You're going to tell me, I ask everybody, you're going to tell me that that story flies at home? Listen, we're all adults here. Mm. Pero eso fue un tarro. Eso fue un tarro. And for people who listening who don't know what the fuck tarro is, tell them. When, cuando te pega un tarro. You can't tell them in Spanish if they don't, don't know, fucking I'm understand gonna, it. Oh, okay. Jesus Christ, <laughs> give me a chance. Cuando te pega un tarro, which means when they, they stick a horn or, or you, you're growing horns. When you grow horns in the Hispanic culture, that's because your girl played you. So every time your girl plays you, your fucking horns come out a little more. Like, it's just a, you know, it's some bullshit we do as Hispanics. Like, it's, it's I, I don't know. I'm, I'm Hispanic as fuck, and I've been hearing this for a minute, and then... And I don't know if I can say this correctly. Quenos Qu 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 is another well, one. Well, I was going to say, if it's in the Cuban, you know, uh, demograph, then I'm going to say that, like, I know, Tarro is like, you're cheating. Someone's cheating. Yeah, but, of course, cheating. But, 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 but I was saying, trying to get more. Like, yeah, exactly. Every time your girl plays you, the horn comes out. That's what they, that's like the, you the, know. The concept behind it, right. Te están pegando los tarro. Every time you get cheated on, the horns grow out a little more. So listen, talking about all that cons conspiratorial stuff, right? We got to entertain it because no one knows. Or we got to we got to entertain that you have your concept of regards to God, and you have you know uh, creation. What came first, chicken or the egg? We we literally we literally spoke about that off the cam. Um, let's entertain the possibilities of extraterrestrials being involved. I know you've heard the concept that what if. Okay. They they came they and visited and partook in this whole DNA well, mixture so, so, that made the human uh, being. Well, that's, so that's Do you the, believe that's the, a possibility? That's the whole Prometheus shit. And kind yes, of is, yes. 100%. I believe in that. So, in, in my opinion, the more explainable, that's the more explainable theory. Throws me off when you believe in that. Let me cut you off. It throws me off when you believe in that's that. That's the more explainable one. But it throws me off when you believe I'm in that. I'm open to everything, Wesley. Yeah, but you're entertaining. Motherfucker, I just put the shit out because you goddamn was just, the smoke was on in my shit. The, uh, the fact that you entertain enough of the um, godly concept, the he's involved and so on and so in forth. In that case, they would be our fucking god. If there was, if, if you know, so you know that that's what Prometheus is. Prometheus is basically our god. They create, yeah, they they, they entertain almost. They're the our Anun god. The Anunnaki. When you create something, you're you're their god. You get what I'm saying? Let me pour you a fucking cup. I got it right here. Yes, of course, of course, and a that's little, a little zippy whippy though. Just a little thing thing. You can't because I can't be on camera drinking this shit. Is it? Is it? Is it is Why? It? I'm kidding, motherfucker. The fuck is this a little bit shy one? This one. Oh my goodness! I kept, on, I, I kept doing this song, guys. Ego. Anyhow, I, I think that that's a concept that's very entertainable. I think it has rights to be entertaining. The Prometheus. Person. You keep saying Prometheus. I'm saying the alien intervention, extraterrestrial it's intervention. Prometheus. Prometheus is okay, you you, you, there were humanoids. Watcher, okay. That's not a that's not a movie, dickhead. Movies are made from from written literature. Okay, so where did that literature come from? Pro, so Prometheus is a concept that again, we're we're a fucking byproduct of a humanoid from another planet coming here 
and uh, fucking uh, Ins- inseminating a, a Neanderthal. Yes. So, so you, you know about the, the the missing link, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where yeah. they don't know how monkeys yeah. converted to humans. Right. That is where the Prometheus is is uh like. It, yeah, they're trying to say that where because of possibility. Yeah. And a, a human, and, and then that's why we started looking the way we started looking. But the Prometheus concept is that a humanoid uh, alien came here, saw, it fucked the Neanderthal, and then that's, I'm be real. No, I know, I know, I know that's exactly I what they say. I don't know if it's a Neanderthal, but they fucked no, it the was, early, that was, that was the concept, early version, yes. Yes. wherever the missing link was. They did it, they did it to, to make a labor race. A la- oh, like slaves. slaves. Exactly. Okay. To, to, well, what are we harvesting to, for to, them now? To, to help construct uh, whatever it is that they want to construct it. And that's the concept, especially when you're talking about the I Sumerians and all that. You know? Sumerians? That, so, yes. that goes back to Sumerians? Sumerian tablets. The Sumerian tablets talk about that. Yo, yeah, I was just watching a show the other day. So they think that civilizations were only like, bro, uh, I can't tell the real number. But it it was definitely like three four hundred BC, and they're figuring out that motherfuckers were around with full civilizations twenty thousand years before twenty thousand. Yeah, yeah. But, but like yeah, sewage systems. Yeah, India right now in twenty twenty three, Indians in India are shitting on the streets and in the. Tigris is it the Tigris or the they, God, they, they put per, they, River? They, they put dead bodies into the the Tigris. Uh, fuck river. that! Fuck that body! Putting dead bodies. What I'm trying to tell you is that India has a billion people and they don't have a proper sewage system. Right. The majority of that country, all the people, because in India they have like a caste system <coughs> where. So the beautiful thing about America, as much as everybody hates us, we have the biggest middle class in the world. That's what makes us fucking different. Like, we have a lot of people that are doing good. Even the people that, some of the, a lot of the people that are in the poverty levels, they live better than kings in other countries. Right. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. India, their caste system. It really fucking it cuts a line between elite versus middle versus and there's right. virtually no fucking middle class. Right, it's just the it's rest. It's elite and, and everyone else. The rest, yeah. They outside of the fucking major where all the rich people live. <laughs> look it up, bro. And it's crazy because it's almost like you, you like the same way everybody's anti Semitic you're anti Semitic because they say something negative about Jews. When you fucking say anything about sh- them shitting on their fucking streets or in the river, oh my god, you're the fucking xenophobic. Get the fuck out of here. They don't have a sewage system. They, all their, the majority, wow. and, hey, the majority of their fucking civilians, and, and, and it sucks because it's not like you feel, we almost feel bad for them, but it's almost like, Jesus, they go into their fucking, the river, and every, that's the morning routine is go there, shit there on the river. This is the source of all water for the fucking country. So, and by the way, they've done tests. The so that you know, in any water you drink ever, there's fecal matter. Shit. Point zero percentages. Right. Theirs is times twenty four. Twenty four times the the average. Holy motherfuck. And over there, it's very common to just see somebody just go, uh, they pull up the, the gown. Energy, focus, weight loss, recovery. All the things that you need to be able to live a very healthy and productive life. But what if we could be able to offer you all of these things in the comfort and convenience of your home? Flueless Mobile Wellness is the company that would be able to make all of those dreams come true. With enough energy and focus, all of your dreams will become a reality. We are here to serve. I, I definitely vibe 100% with uh, we're all gods because I believe we create, we destroy, we intervene, we can... can I don't think we're gods because of that. I, 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 I do, I do, I do. Okay. I, I think I we, 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 we can change 
other species' lives. We can alter shit. We there, we have every godly power. Okay, so I agree that we're gods in that sense. So let me let me rephrase that. I agree that we are gods in that sense. But in my true definition of a god, the the only the only association I make with uh, us and God, I think we're God because of how we're like naturally built to function. So whatever made us, which is, well, I think we already agreed, that's our God. That's our real God. Whatever made us, made us with these fucking systems, bro. Yo, your brain is stupid. I know. Your body is stupid. Your digestive system is stupid. Your reproductive system is stupid. They made us with such fucking intricacy. That it's yo, this shit wasn't by mistake. But the brother. part, but the part that throws me off, Marcos, when you say that is one concept that you believe is not vibing with the other. If, if, if they made, if they made us like this, mm -hmm. then there was no evolution. They just fast forward, jumped into it, and made us as such. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up. Are you hold saying? Up, 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 up. Are you saying that they? What do you mean? There was no evolution. So, we know in time that there was. You, we we agree that there was dinosaurs, right? Okay, yeah, we can. Uh, listen, I believe so in what, evolution. So what I believe are you in evolution. About? If they intervene and made us where our bodies do the immaculate things that they do and this was an evolution what are you saying are you saying that when they when they did evolution what it, when they did big bang no one did evolution when did god say let there be and when did he decide to intervene again like he just fucking broke a rack of fucking balls in billards when well, he decided it's his shot again to, you have to if you're interested in coming up with an answer to that, you have to decide what you believe in. Science says that after a certain period, after a certain apocalypse, X amount of years later, humans, and, and if I, I want to, I, I would dare say there was fucking humans before we even think, but either way, there was an apocalypse, the fucking, the meteorite, and then, thousands of years later, there was signs of humans. There's plenty of things that would tell you that the the chemical reaction from the apocalypse is what causated human life. Because if I'm not mistaken, we were That's made, a theory. We were made from water. Theory. We were made from water, bro. We were as far, fish. As far as the first amoeba. Listen, we were fish. You need water and, and heat. From you need water. water and heat. Yeah, we came from and water. And then you have the bacteria. I'm, I'm, I'm no expert, and I'm not going to pretend like if I fucking know. Like, I'm not well-versed in that. But I know we came. I want to say we came from fucking water. I just, listen, listen the only thing. And it was after the apocalypse that killed off okay, right. the last version. So if, if, if we're going on the ant farm theory. I feel like whoever is doing that ant farm said, hey, let me fucking test out these little dinosaur looking fucking things. That shit didn't work out. And that motherfucker said, fuck all this shit. And bam, now we're the next test. We're the next fucking social experiment. I I, I think. And it's crazy because. I'm, bro, not gonna, I'm not going to even say I think. I'm, I'm just going to say that. If I'm gonna, if I'm gonna entertain, hey, listen, listen, this, listen. Another thing, another, thing, another thing we should mention. My bad, my bad. But another thing we should mention is that we are the first, and that might give you a lot more insight or give you more reason. We're the first animal, or we're the first generation of animals with consciousness. You're assuming, done, done, because you're assuming. There's no facts. There's no you facts. Think dinosaurs were conscious. There's no. There, there's just no facts that there was another. Dinosaurs wrote. That there was another. Uh, there was another history. intelligent species before us that got wiped out. Oh, there's just no facts. Oh, but I agree with Graham that. Hancock. No, is, 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 no, no, no. But you, you, you're 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 missing. You're talking about the human race in, in in general. Since we were fucking since yeah, Homo sapiens since that race came around. So you don't think this process ever happened again before? No, like before dinosaurs. There's no evidence. It, 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 of course there's no evidence. It's all been... No, you know, just, there, this, there is evidence in the fucking dirt. You can you can track history through the dirt. Of course, until until a, a until, meteor fucking destroys everything and it's like there's no way we can no, get that. It's still there. Into. It's still there. It all, no, what are you talking about, guy? 
I'm a fucking nerd watching that shit. You, I really you're am. wrong about this. Then I don't know if you're a nerding. I they're, don't know they're, what, the fuck you know. what I'm saying the is the meteor happened. So hey, by the way, okay. No, no, no. But, but, fun fact. But, but let's, no, 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 no. Let me cut you off. Fun fact. No, no, no. Because I want to jump to all these other topics, bro. Right. Listen, it's not that I'm trying to close out with the last thing. It's not that. What I'm saying is this: if there is a a a godly person who intervenes, who stirs shit up, because hey, the ant farm is you know fucking around, and, my liking. and I want to fuck around and stir shit up. <clears throat> You're talking about. A countless amount of times that he decided to stir shit up throughout the existence of, and I'm only countless. Re- I'm only like five times. I'm only referring to countless. It's like five times. Planet Earth. I'm yeah. only referring to Planet Earth because if you're gonna entertain that he has an involvement on stirring shit up, so every meteor that hits no, Earth, no, 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 ca- bro, oh, I can, I can go in. Commission- I can go in on this. Commissioner of the Galaxy now. I can, yeah, exactly, exactly. Get the they, fuck out of here. They should fucking hire get me for, the, for Galaxy. Get the fuck out of here. Guardians of the Galaxy Part Three. Hey, Angelo, this guy's a fucking clown guy. All right, listen. This guy's a clown, Angelo. Back to 2022. <laughs> Russia invades Ukraine, man. That's huge. That's bullshit. Yeah, you think it's bullshit? It sucks, man. Yeah, I mean, uh, is this going to build something? It's not bullshit. Is, Russia, is, is, Russia wants Ukraine back. Is this going to become something bigger that drips on over to America, uh, to real, American the real, involvement? The real problem here, what do you mean American involvement? American we, involvement? We've already sent them Money. close to a trillion dollars. Yeah, no. which that makes no sense because we don't even have a trillion dollars. It's just make-believe money. It's fucking stupid. It's retarded. A carton of eggs is $10. Okay, I know I get that. I'm just saying we have no business. No, no, what I'm saying is, our fucking produce, our daily expenses, our cost of living here is astronomical compared to history. We're sending a trillion dollars to a fucking country. That what? What the fuck do we care if Russia takes back Ukraine? I get it, bro. I get all the fucking bullshit to you liberals. Uh, if Russia were to take back Ukraine, it's not like Ukraine is producing the uh, exports that we're fucking benefiting from. We don't want to lose. It's not that, a, right. If Russia took back Ukraine, what the fuck would it do to the U.S.? It's not about that. Nothing. No, it's it's humanity. It's okay, there you oh, go. you gotta have compassion, right? Oh. So, 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 sk- skip to the humanity part, fuck, because because we, we know there's yeah, no other shit. Hey, those so, problems are gonna go on no matter what. Are we, you're gonna get in every single fucking problem. Okay, so I personally think, mind your fucking business, stay of in your course. lane. Me too. There's no way that the state of our country that it's in that we can afford or should be sending. Not even a fucking, a not even a not cold a mill. Yeah, exactly. You're saying a dollar. Send not them, even a cold them, mill. You know, you know in the NBA, fucking trills. You know, you know in the championships in the NBA, how they print shirts no matter what side and it is. And then whoever, whoever send loses, those shirts. exactly. That's what you send over here. Yeah, those shirts. A uh, participation. A participation. The ones that never made uh, it. The champions yeah. that were never champions. Fucking they, dog. But but to be honest with you, you know, and, and we'll move on to the next topic. It's still a scary situation. Because Putin, you know, you know, you know, you know, scared of Putin, bro. Listen, I know, I know you're not, but the only thing that I'll say is this: because I'm a Trump listen, man. Listen, listen, oh, listen. Because I love Putin. Hey, man. hey, hey, oh, Putin, man. hey, Putin, is, Putin is literally dying of cancer, and and it's just hard why, to think. Why do you think that? Because I think it. I don't want to debate that this whole thing. Fucking gay. You, you're talking listen, about the whole fucking God listen, thing, and now you're fucking here talking about. Listen, what, where did you hear Can Putin? I finish this shit? But where did you hear Putin? Okay. When, when, when you got somebody who's, you hear that? who's on their last leg, you hear that? and they think the way that guy where thinks, that? It's, it's a little scary. It's a where little you, scary. Where you hear that? that? That's all I'm saying. Where did you hear that? And by the way, when someone's on their last leg, that's when you get the worst of them, because they know they're on the way out. Exactly That's what I'm saying That's why it's a little bit scary He's like that guy That guy was KGB How old do you think he is Caballo? He's 50 something 60 50 something 50 something 60 something What are you saying? 
What are you trying to say, bro? Can you, can you stop you're, being you're so... Make, you're making it seem like stop it's... Stop being so fucking suspenseful. You you're you're making it seem like it's so hard to believe that he might not be dying. What? Whatever point in the fact that Putin is dying, brother? Because if he's dying, he's the fucking president of a goddamn country that what has What I'm saying is what, nukes, what would nukes. say that he's dying? No, this is fucking bullshit. Who's to say he's dying? It was Russian news. So they're just all lying. Can, can, can you show me that? They all can lying. Can you show me that? Okay. Can you show me that? Bro, guess Putin. what? He died. Yeah, Putin's dead. He died. Putin's dead. <laughs> <fucking great. laughs> Listen, anyhow, back, 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 back to the list. So that's a bad situation. I hope it, I hope it goes. Well, we'll see. We'll see who's, who's bluffing, who's this. All right. Roe got overturned by the Supreme Court. I think that's bullshit. You think he didn't get overturned? Or you think it's a bad call? I think it's a bad call. You think women should have the stop, right to... Stop fucking with them, bro. Stop fucking with them. Without, without, without any cap, though? Republic, Republic, but, but, but without any cap, Republicans are the first ones. Listen, bro. But let's, every but time, but every but let's time, just talk about abortion on its own. No, hold up. Every time you ask a Republican, why are you a Republican? You go... Well, because I want less government intervention. Every fucking Republican says, I want less government intervention. <clears throat> but then when it fucking comes to abortion, they want the government to determine whether you can or cannot fucking get an abortion. If you think it's so ungodly. So as Republican as you are, you're against that part. I'm, bro, when you say that, like I get, I get you for thinking that I'm Republican. It's just like everybody else. I'm very far from fucking Republican. Okay, I like that. I respect that. Listen, to me, I'm it, the best term for me, and it is what I am. It just the party doesn't exist virtually or essentially is a libertarian, which is yo. If it's up to me, it's up to me. Leave me the fuck alone, bro. Mm -hmm. And if it's up to me, all drugs would be legal. And it's not because oh, I want to have access to the drugs. It's Bro, you believe in that concept. Your right? government should not be imprisoning people for things that they want to do. If you're a junkie, bro, even if, even if it leads them to do crimes, and it's proven that that it, that inhibits arrest, them to arrest do crimes, them, arrest them. They're gonna do. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. So you're suggesting that just because you make something illegal, that someone's not gonna do it? No, not at all. But but if if, if you establish a rule, you establish a rule for a reason. If it, let's talk about the logic behind the reason. Whether drugs are legal I'm or not, not, I'm not just with saying Listen, like fucking wow wow west. Hey, like, but hold up, but whether drugs are legal or not, if you do something wrong, it's wrong, is it not? Whether yes. whether who establishes if it's wrong? No, no. We're, we're, but we're back to that though. We mm. have to. There has to be an establishment right of what's wrong. considered wrong. There's law. There's law. Okay, what I'm trying so you to establish say is, law. Don't, but don't make. Consumption of a substance illegal. That's not up to the government. If you want to go and consume a substance that makes you act a certain illegally, then you're going to get arrested by law. Don't go. In other words, let people expose themselves. Are you a fucking junkie? It's legal. Go ahead. Be the junkie you are. First wrong thing you do, bitch, you will. That's how I believe that I'm libertarian like that. Right. I think that money taxes should only be used for law enforcement and fire. IRS, uh, Federal Reserve, suck my dick, bitch. The government does need money to run, but there should be a flat tax. I'm liberal. I'm telling you, I'm very liberal. Okay. I mean, there's a, nobody's in a flat I, tax. I, I, I know there's people. Uh, I know, I know there's Ron, people. What's that, the old guy? The old, Bernie Sanders yeah. He believes in the flat oh, No 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 no. My bad It was uh, Ron Paul He believes in the flat tax So more than anything You think women Should have the right yeah, I'm pro-choice And you don't it's, And it's you don't and, and you don't think There's a cap on that what, What's a cap What do you mean Like up to Up to a certain time frame Oh no You, you should not have More than two three months Okay and then Therefore at that point You have to uh, Implement some type of Reprimandation Some type of repercussion it's not legal. I'm saying if the you're, repercussion is that it's illegal. If if, if, you're, if you're gonna okay, but to what extent is it punishment? Is what I'm saying. After like three months, I, I would say that. If, yeah, after three months, it's, it's a little bit too more. It's too developed. So, in, in other words, so you had ample time. Okay, you had ample time. So only allow it up until then, uh -huh. and then after then, you you force them to have to have it. 
No, it's a crime. So, at all. so they can still abort. You can know you can, but they face a charge. Exactly. Okay. You, you can you can try them. The state all can right, try right. them. That, that, that's what I'm trying to get out of you. I, I don't want just you know uh, uh, do this, do that. No, no. Put a little bit of support behind it. Why? Why do you want them to do this or do that? All right. All right. I know. I know that. Um, nah. If I get you, if I get you hooked on that Trump shit, you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna go off on it. I'm going for it. <laughs> yeah. All right. Have you seen the videos of, of the effects of the climate changes that's been going on? Climate what? I mean, from a- Antarctica and just Antarctica on its own. Uh-huh. The biggest chunks uh-huh. ever uh-huh. have been what falling off of that shit. No, I'm saying, how you feel about that? What, what do you think that's going to lead to? I, do, do you ever dig into I'm that type hoping, of shit? So I'm hoping, I'm hoping. You know that the water's going to rain. Sense, the water's so, going to rain. And by the way, in that sense, I'm very Republican. <laughs> I'm the motherfucker. I'm the motherfucker that thinks that. Given the data, and again, I'm not going to pretend like I'm any kind of fucking scientist, right. but from what I've read or I have act with the information I have access to, the climate has yo-yoed. The, the temperature of the the planet has yo-yoed. Throughout life? Are you talking about yeah. as, of, as of recent? Throughout the last two, two three thousand years. Right. This is expected, no matter what. It's so in other words, it's just but it's a, a little it's a enhanced. cycle. It's a so, cycle. But it's a little enhanced. A little enhanced. I agree with you. It is cycled. It's cycled. And they and they and they tend to underplay that hey, this happens every so and so many years. But it's a little enhanced because I, I don't think so, so, Bro, with the so, amount of technology and the amount know, of fuels that we're well, burning, well, come well, on now. How can you not say that I, that's not playing a role? I don't think I don't think it plays a role like that. The fucking smog, like the smog that's worldwide. There's just so many different things. How could you not? Okay, so the, by the way, let's go a little deeper than that. So we're talking about climate change or glo- global warming, right? You know what? Another I, just, one? I, I just, I just feel like no, no, no. no. Okay, so listen, no, no, hold on. Up. So the answer, I don't want you to dodge. What, no, what? but listen, the answer to a lot of that shit is electric, right? You want to talk about hypocrisy and I, I, irony? The answer. To a lot of those global warming things, go electric. We gotta, you gotta leave fossil fuels. Which, by the way, did you know that fossil fuels are all dinosaurs? You know that all the gas that we, all the gas that we pump through our cars, that we, you know, when we dig that up, that was the layer of dinosaurs exactly that just disintegrated and became fossil right. fuels. Not just dinosaurs, but all species that fossil. It was majority okay. dinosaurs. The majority of fossil fuels are from dinosaurs. Okay. So the answer to global warming is going electric, right? So did you know? But it's not. I, I'm not but in agreement with no, you. No, 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 that, no, no. It's not the answer. I'm not saying that. That's what they say. Okay. You got to go electric. Bro, California... Gave gives gives you a certain kind of benefit if you have an electric car. That's their answer. They're saying that you can again. The war is against fossil fuel, combustible engines, mm-hmm. gas. They want you to go electric. This is what I'm getting at. The irony is to to build an electric engine, you need uranium, right? In order to dig up that uranium. For every uranium battery, the tractors and the gas that, that's used to dig up that uranium is like a thousand times the expense. Bro, I just... In other words, trying to be... Trying to be uh, uh, combat global warming right. makes it worse. Even worse. And and I've seen multiple videos on this on different levels of all, of all sorts. And for one... The biggest technological item that we use universally throughout the world, throughout the planet, is the phone, phone. right? And from my understanding, I just saw, um, well, credit to Joe Rogan. Shout out to Joe Rogan. He just had this guy who, who filmed the docuseries and wrote his, 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 his next book based upon this. This dude went to the center of Africa to where they're digging up all the, um, where they're mining the, um, I think it's uranium for mm-hmm. the batteries in the phones. Mm-hmm. 
And it's supposed to be a corporate ordeal. Tractors, machines, this and that. Bro, that guy's got film. That shit looks like something out of fucking... Um, War of the Worlds? Nah. Like, it's, it's for sure slavery, but I was going to say... no. Oh, um, Indiana Egypt, Jones. Indi Egypt. Was, yeah, Egypt. Indi I was going to say Indiana the, Jones. The pyramids type shit. Bro, you see people hammering, digging. You hear all the... Oh, the blah, 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 blah. They're all talking to, <clears throat> talking Yo, to each other. Say that racist shit again. Bro, it's... Say that racist shit again. How many people... How many people... No, 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 no. So that, was, that, that, that was my Angelo, uh, make sure you put this shit in there, Angelo. That, that was my uh, my interpretation. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. Of, of what Racist they, ass motherfucker. Speak order. What do they speak order? Oh know. no, continue, continue digging that grave, kiddo. Hey. Angelo, put this shit in. Yeah, there. yeah, you keep you keep this there. But no, for real though, what the dude said and what he experienced and what he witnessed and what he recorded and what he pictured, dog, is crazy. He said this is. Modern day slavery on another level that you cannot imagine. Yeah, and when he this broke it all down, China, nigga, uh, so look, LeBron shoes. So this, 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 this Joe, shoes. Joe Rogan, Joe Rogan. Yeah, you're right. Joe Rogan. We know that his following is in the mills, 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 mills. All right. Much more than that. So he had this guy, and now we wonder one that of the biggest. You. That was you. One of the biggest topics. No, the other wasn't. That one was of, you. One of the biggest. That was you. One of the biggest topics was, now what, Joe? Because I'm on your show, and the world's going to hear every bit of it, so on and so forth. You didn't light it up. Oh, uh, yeah, it felt warm. <laughs> that was the one. Um, and they were thinking, you know, because, okay, for one, Tesla, Joe Rogan's homeboy, Elon Musk. I know we all got love for him. I do. I definitely do. Nobody. He's one of boy, those. Boy crush. He's one of those people who's going to have. Listen, he's one of those people who's going to have to. Make a huge adjustment and take a pay cut if he was to say, "All right, from here on out, I'm not purchasing anything from over there because these people manufacture a shitload of all the." He has no advertisers no it, more. It, by the way, it's great. He has no advertisers. Who does it? Elon. When Elon took over, I'm not talking about Twitter though. I'm not talking about Twitter. I know. Oh, but what I'm trying to tell you is. He's not making bread off of that app. He's willing to take losses just to help the world out. Hundo. You really think that though, right? I think that I might be a schmuck. No, no, no. I'm with you on that. But that's one. Doesn't that's that one feel? Those... Doesn't that feel weird to think that about somebody who's so like, damn, this motherfucker is losing billions. Heck oh, but he's a billionaire. Doesn't matter. He's losing billions every to make the world a little bit better, a little bit and, better, and, a little and, bit and, better. And the people that don't agree with that are like, oh, he just wants power. He just wants to be there. No, no, bitch. He's, he's already a, there. He's top 10. I can call any shot I want. He doesn't give a fuck about you, bro. Yeah, get out of here. He's a, and, and again, if you would tell me, if, if if Elon Musk was making bread hand over fist off of Twitter, I'll be like, we're getting played. Yeah, there's something, there's some, there's some, there's some, some underlining. Yeah, exactly. But he's losing yeah. astronomical fucking loot. You know, you Man, know, you fucking, dirt, 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 fucking these liberals, bro. You, you know, and, fuck, I, and, and we got fuck damn, what they think. And I hate to say that on that note because you went back to them. I'm not a liberal Republican. I'm nothing. I'm so new to this fucking political shit. But whack, on that bro. note, on that note, though, Republicans are whack too. What is? Republicans are whack too. Yeah, all oh, that's just a little bit just too much, man. It, it really is. You know? Politicians are whack, bro. All right, so something that just happened right before the new year ended. The world population, and it's great that I, I bring this up now because uh, Elon Musk had a, a huge podcast with Joe Rogan that he talked about this. The world population just passed 8 billion. Is it so pretty? Yeah. The world population. Most people don't know how to. But we've been, to, a, we've been they, at 7 they, for a minute. Well, regardless, we've been, seven. Most we've been people, seven for like 10, 15 years. That number is still huge, bro. For it, sure. It's ginormous. But, but, hey, but hold on. The, the crazier part is. But do you, do you remember what Elon said? India has a billion. A bill? One bill? No. So One bill? Just, just so you know, always and forever, since we've been alive, India and China both have a billion. They represent... Over twenty to thirty percent of the popul world's Holy population. Shit. India has over a billion. China has over a billion. <clears throat> Always and forever, since you and I have been alive, 
maybe a little after. I don't know. I'm, but I'm pretty sure since we've been alive, Ch- China and India, a bit in each. And we only have 320. <laughs> mill or mill? Mill. mill? mill. Get the fuck out of here, Bill. Mill. Mill. We're, we're bosses, bro. We're bosses, bro. We're the, la- we're, the la- we're the longest standing empire in history. We're bosses. Now, do, do, do you feel, and I, and I like that you say that, because I, I, listen, I agree with you before you get all fucking being going about it. Doesn't that, doesn't that make us a constant target? We've been targets for Okay, okay, but, 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 but motherfuckers get better. Motherfuckers get more uh, weapons. We got nuclear. And, uh, we and, uh, got nuclear. So do that's others. That's, so no, do others. No, no. So again, that's the same. It's the same thing. I'm not trying to stir so it up, but it's real. It. No, no, no. But so it's it's a very very and it's real, scary, but motherfucker. It's a, it's a real it's a real conversation. And again, that's why it always comes down to this: the only people that matter in the planet, and unfortunately, is Russia, China, and the U.S. <clears throat> And hey, North Korea, they fucking pretend. I don't even think their fucking nukes work. You hit it hard. You work out hard. But do you recover as hard as your exercises? Recovery is the number one thing that keeps most athletes from reaching the next level. Here at Flueless Mobile Wellness, we want to help you become the animal, the champion, the winner that you are. Recover right. Recover with Flueless Mobile Wellness. All right, so let, 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 let me take it to a whole nother realm. I, and, and you might have remembered this in the past because, you know, we again, we, we vibed on so many tips from so many long conversations, getting high, getting drunk, all this good stuff. You know I'm a, UF, a UFO. Uh, I'm an alien believer too, bro. You know, all that good stuff, right? I don't, But I don't want to sound like these, you know, nutcase fanatics, right? But <laughs> if you believe in as alien, a reason, you, you there. 2022, mm-hmm. government... In whatever weak ass way, it, you know, it. Yeah, yeah, what, it but and and and, and 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 there's plenty of ways to poke at it. Why are you mad, bitch? I'm not. I'm just saying. I don't want to come off like that overly, you know, whatever. But the fact that they now said what they said, what they say, we didn't. We don't know what the fuck that was, okay. and we don't think that that was from uh, uh, man made. We don't think that was from our opponents. They admitted it. As it, ain't as that, from, it ain't from Earth, it, and and it, and you know what? And, and I remember I seen because I've seen so many interviews. There are scientists who have the right to say like you can't prove that because you didn't go there, test it, and and tell oh, was it okay? So well, all you can say is we don't know what it is, where it's from, and it is showing signs of technology that we have not personally experienced. Experienced, yet. but you personally believe it is UFOs. Yes. 100%. Man. I think there's, of course. I think there's aliens, bro. I think 100% I think there's aliens. Bro, I, listen, I, but, even, but, I even entertain the fact of that, that there's, you never, you never heard the, the theory that there's aliens that exist right Amongst here, right us. now. Yes, of In course. a different frequency. Yeah. Bro, I entertain that. I'm, I'm all about that life. If, if, if it is them, right, and I'm, and I'm with you on that, obviously, um, do you think these are like probes? You think these are like, um, you know, they're watching us. They're they're they're, they're observing us. They're they're now they are field. I love this concept, by the way. They're the field biologists. They're the gods. So, so okay, and they're, well, and they're, well, and they're well, coming well, back. They're coming. Say they're coming back. I'll fucking twist your nipple. They're coming back to visit the ant farm. Well, that's what I was about to ask. But are that's we, too Prometheus. No, 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 no. So my question is. If we're going to entertain the fact that there's aliens, why why do the aliens have to be our gods? I say creators. Just, I say creators. They're I just coming back why, to watch. Why do they have to be our creators? Why? I, they I don't. Think, you're right. I think that they have to be, maybe they were all created by a fucking, <clears throat> the, the overlaying fucking. So look, on a, on a, on a planetary scale, and this and is why. These, this, these, these are just beings that are more advanced than us within our galaxy. And they're observing. Uh, listen, I think they're observing. But if, they're if, not our gods. If, uh, uh, I don't I, think aliens are our gods. I can, I, I can agree with you 100%, okay? Unless we, gotta, unless we go the Prometheus route. So look. Unless I, we go the Prometheus route, then. Than the human, you have to show me. A, I want. I want. I want. I, okay. Do you understand that the Prometheus? Yeah, yes, yes, I do. Is, I do. It's a larger version of like a human, like a. I get it. Well, I saw that in a the humanoid movie. in the movie. I saw that right. So that's how you get the fucking. Let, let, let me make this clear really quick. 
I do slightly believe in that Prometheus thing, right? But I, I don't want to go into that detail of that. I do believe that through the Anunnaki theory, and if anybody wants to look that up, please go ahead and do so. Um, but I, I don't want to go deep into that. What I do want to entertain, though, is that as a species, us, as a human species in this planet, regardless of how we got here, we're here, you, me, whatever, everybody, centuries before us, what we have done as a human species is explore, explorations, mm -hmm. command and conquer. Yeah. Let's study this this foreign land, these foreign people, and 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 then at some point intervene. Kill them. <laughs> I didn't say that. And take their land. <clears throat> yeah, all that. Nothing wrong with that. It's been hey, it's it's, it's the way of the world. Here, exactly. Even from 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 small amoebas. All the way up to the biggest apex predator. Survivor the of the fittest. Survivor hey, of those who can adapt the most. I'm taking over if I yeah, can. Yeah. And we as humans are the only ones that are able to reason beyond okay, so, killing. So, but if we did that amongst ourselves, so we, we both believe in that concept, right? So we did that amongst ourselves for the amount of whatever years you want to believe in that we have. We've done that. Done what? Command and conquer, uh -huh, explore. Command and conquer is all you need to Discover, command and conquer. Command and conquer. Now, if we're going to entertain the possibilities of an alien race, extraterrestrials, whether it's one or multitude of them, who are popping up in these UFOs, we're going to call them that respectfully, you know, un unidentified can flying can objects, can it not be like us? Prior to where we're at right now, even though we still do it now, we still go into these foreign, virginic um, Yo, so, um, uh, uh, cultures in regards to like rainforests, Virginia. Amazon, yeah, Virginia, like never been touched by any other human, uh, Amazonian shit, New Zealand type shit, certain uh, shit in the Australian, no, no, in the Australian, no, no. you know, outback. Right. Well, we do that as humans. I don't, I don't exploring. think, I don't think that just, just, I think there's a, too much credit given to. Uh, undeveloped or uncivilized tribes and shit. There's a lot of okay. there's a lot of magic in their culture, their natural culture. <clears throat> but I don't think there's don't I don't think we should. Yes, I I'm I'm tanning in the morning now. I'm I'm trying to get more in touch with Earth. But their underdevelopment is nothing to fucking praise. Right, but 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 what what impact do they have on the the possibility of the the aliens? What do you mean? You talking about as in what tribal people? Like I'm yeah, not, tribal I'm, people. Yeah, but I'm talking not, about the New Zealand motherfuckers. Well, I'm just saying that the only last bit of virginic populations or or or, or rainforests uh -huh. or, or or areas that haven't been touched aside from that island of those people who murk anybody uh -huh. who tries to get close. There's so very few. I don't know how many there are. I think they're under 10. But the same way we as a human population want to continue exploring and finding out what goes on here and how can we intervene and how can whatever, whatever, whatever. If there's alien races out there, they would do the same on an interplanetary fashion. We're continentally hopping, right? We're going from a continent to a continent to a continent exploring. We got South America, Amazonian forests, rivers, uh, Peruvian mountains, all these structures, blah, blah, blah. We got Africa, yeah, all that whole, bullshit. The whole, the whole command and conquer thing, it was just a byproduct of technology. The more technology mm. there was, the more technology, weapons, firearms, everything, that's what determined who was in charge. But what I'm saying is if, 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 Species want to always expand and, can, and protect their species, right? Mm -hmm. Pack of wolves, pack of lions, pack of whatever, monkeys. Like, we need to branch out. We need to establish. We need to find where there's more food. We need to, we need yeah, to, we need to. Survive. We all do that up until the human race. So, if we're going to entertain that there might be extraterrestrials, aliens, those who are somehow intervening, watching us, what observe, whatever the fuck. Yeah. I would love to easily entertain the fact that they can be just like us and they're just planet hopping. 
And they're and they're over yeah, here like, oh, yeah, you, you what's going want, on over here? You just, yeah, yeah, because that's that's just an that's easier thing to wild. believe. Look at this shit. That's just an easier thing to believe, bro. You think it's only because it's easier to believe? That's that, that's why that's why I think you entertain that theory because it's easier to believe that it's just like, oh, look, this is just one of our M farms, and there's a bunch of little M farms, and there's this higher race that's closer to so us. So what? What, what would make think, what would make want, it what would make it more difficult? I then? think you want your God to be physical. What cons- I think you want your God to be physical. I don't ever think about a God. That's the thing, though. What? Well, so what concept you don't do think you about think? God? I never do. You never think about God. Nothing about God. Not a prayer, you're, you're not a prayed? thought, not a nothing. I, I haven't done that in over twenty years. Prayed? Yeah. I I broke off from that concept. That no, belief. Well, see, I'm not. I'm not a. I'm not a. I'm not. You know, I'm not religious. No shit. Right? You, uh, uh, I pray. You pray. Okay. I pray though, but I pray to my God. I pray to the person that to the. You the, believe there's somebody there hearing you? I think that concept is is a little wild. I know. I, I don't. I think. I think. I mean, you don't meditate though. It, yes, I do. Do you do you do meditate? Yes, yeah. I'm sorry. So, but it, so you you don't but, think you don't? But how you do you define meditation? You, you, don't, you don't you don't you don't think you have a connection to the universe, bro? I honestly feel I know this sounds crazy. I I talk to myself like oh, I, I just saw a post the other day. Like, they, like, they like, compared like, everything. Listen, the universe is an, is an organism, bro. We're all and, I, and, I know. And I get. I get down. And and I and I will talk to the universe. Yes, but when I talk to the universe, I talk to the universe like that's what I'm talking to. That's what I'm talking to when I talk. Well, I don't want you to say that I because pray. Well, because you're I'm labeling to, well, you're labeling it a god. That's no, but different. I said you're looking I, I, at I told it you with earlier, entitlement. I told you earlier that I think we're all God. I think God is in all of us when we love each other. Yo, that's God. The the emotions that we share. If, if we hate each other Is that God? That's God Everything is fucking Yo Everything that we Experience That's given to us That's that, that's God to me <laughs> That's God to me All of that shit Heaven and hell That's a story nigga That you were given To pass time <laughs> uh, Bro Bunch of bored ass Immaculate people. conception Suck my dick bro Joseph and Juntaru I hear you. I hear you on that. I do. Fuck but. all that. That that's all a story, bro. Like everything that you experience, the way you treat people, with your experience here, your time here, that's God, bro. To me, I listen. I I, I would never say anything against that. Caballo, like I wouldn't, or, or to anybody believing that. Nor would I ever try. It's to, just my belief, right? And 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 when when I when I I don't want it to seem like I'm like I'm digging my heels in. I just want to hold my ground. I do want to hold my ground, but it's not because I'm going against anything. I want, no, I want, I want, I want no. to hold my ground because I want to let people know, like, Different hey, beliefs. it's just a belief thing. And, belief. And, and and in my life and the way that it brings me so much comfort and whatever else you want to call it, um, we are a, a, the end result as of now to a process that's a, that has occurred. And that obviously sounds like evolution, right? And I, and I, and I like that. I'm cool with that. I believe that if there's a creator, because we always want to think there is a creator, there has to be a creator, right? I'm cool with that. There has to be a creator. It's, it's, I just, I it's just, the pro- it's the acceptance of our existence. Um, if if you exist, you have to be <clears throat> something created you, right? Right. If you accept that you're, yeah, 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 no, no, yeah, yeah. Exactly, no. To- something created that, listen, right? Listen, totally cool with that. Totally cool with that. Totally cool with that. And I, and I can entertain that on different levels. My my whole part, and this is not this is not a contest. This is not to challenge. Hey, I know, I know. My I know my not. my personal belief is there's no involvement of anybody else in anything that goes on from here on out. It's me. It's you. Oh, it's whoever well, okay, it is. So I think what you're getting at is I don't believe in luck either. No, not luck. I'm saying. I mean, luck. Does, luck does exist. No, no, but but I'm not talking about luck. What I'm saying is there's no being outside of this. Actual life that we're living, who can alter anything that I'm going to endure every second moving forward? So, in other words, everything is in my hands, and and there's no reason you can pray to. Oh, but to, I'm not, okay, so I'm not, but I'm not victimizing myself. I'm not saying that. Oh, all right. 
But yeah, I, I, I agree with you. Like, I just don't believe in it. And I don't I mean, believe that's in the whole point of not believing in the Immaculate Conception. Homie, there's no fucking miracles. Don't play with me. Yeah, but I don't even go that far. All, all I'm saying is, I, I just don't believe in an entity that intervenes and helps us out. I just don't believe that. That's all. I, Forget I about believe, everything I before that. that. I don't believe in that either. Okay, well. Then, I never said I did. Well, then we're not that far apart. I don't. I, I never said I believed in that. I don't think that the aliens are helping us. I didn't say aliens, motherfucker. I'm an entity like a god. Uh, either I don't think they're helping a, us either. A deity, a deity. I don't think they're helping us either. I don't so, think that. So your god I doesn't answer your prayers. You just you just pray just to shoot it it's out. It's a meditation. There? It's a meditation. I'm I'm putting it out into the universe. It's manifestation. That that is the very basis of all rituals, by the way. Like brujeria, santeria. You think that there's spirits helping you? That's not the truth. The real basis of all that, the reason they have rituals, is because, again, do you believe in manifesting something? If you speak it into the world, do you believe that you can manifest something? No, I, I don't, you don't think, think that. You think so? Just speaking it, no. I don't like to, I don't like to support that, no. Why? Well, the, 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 the theory is that but, and I'm not. I'm, I'm not just trying to go against no, no, you. No, no, like, no, I hope no, you know no, that. No, I know. What I'm saying is that the theory is speaking it. Turns into action, All right, I which get turns it. into fucking yeah. the the actual manifestation. Yeah, but that's just been that's, a fucking abused, raped, and I don't know all kind of shit. And then people are like, "Yo, you know, so I'm trying to speak into existence," listen, and then they don't fucking back that's, anything that's, up. That's brujeria. So, for example, brujeria. You know when in brujeria when they sacrifice animals, and they do the gunpowder in the show. <laughs> I'm being real. I know. I know. Okay. All that is an impression on the mind. Rituals. And this is something that it's back tribal, but they understood. They understood how heavy manifestation was because, again, back in those days, they weren't dealing with societal issues like us, where we're so caught up in our subconscious. These people were just worried about eating and shitting and sleeping and fucking. <laughs> so rituals to them, again, it's an impression on the brain, and that's what a ritual is. You go through a ritual, and now, Baba, all day, you're thinking about this. Right. And Baba, I guarantee you, you think about something for fucking 90 days at a time, you're going to make something happen. That's all that is. Bro, I couldn't agree with you more. I get it. You know, listen, you can talk yourself into, you can placebo yourself into, you oh, can all that stuff. Rituals. Into, into rituals. anything. And, 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 and I'm, rituals. And, and I'm 100% I'm okay with that. I'm just more making it pretty vocal, you know, that my concept isn't there. My ritual isn't there. I never fell upon a ritual, and I and I understood and, and realized what rituals were. As you well have as, rituals. You as do well, rituals. As well you as traditions, rituals. as well as... You do rituals. Okay. You, you have the, you have your the right... Your process you, is rituals. You have the right to say that because you, I... Your because process I do, is your ritual. Yeah, because I practice something. Yes, that's exactly. a ritual. I get it. That's why I said you have the right to say that. All right. I know I'm right. But my rituals... Don't go into a deity who's uh, um, neither do mine. Oh, some heavenly shit. Neither That's do all. mine. Neither do mine. I think I think you may just misconcept, uh, mis perceiving. Um, uh, I think if you're praying, praying, I think praying. It, yeah, I do. Yeah, no, no, it's bullshit. So, so by the way, I'm not praying. I'm praying to the ever loving. So when I, and by the way, typically when I pray, it's literally only, Lord, whatever the fuck is out there. I swear to God, I, I talk like this to myself. I go. Lord, I love you so much. Thank you for everything. I swear to God, this is exactly how my prayers But go. that throws me off. It is, it is. And, then, saying, and then I go, bro. please protect my family. And protect, I, I start with Landon. I love Landon. Like that. And Landon's like the, just let Landon live past 30. <laughs> that's all I care about. I don't want a little boy. Like, that's, to me, my biggest fucking horror. And that, 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 that's, that's the order of how my prayer goes. Lord, just please protect my family. I love you. And, and, and so, and why is that weird to you? I'm, I, I am very cognitive. I'm very aware that I'm. Something made me, bro. No, no, just, and listen, that's that's who I'm talking to. Kawaii, listen, when I pray, for, first of all, because uh, I have no right to challenge what you believe, so I'm not. I don't, I'm not, I don't so, feel like you're challenging. I'm not. I'm not going that route. But at what all, I'm asking is, why do you the, think that because the praying part is crazy? Because you're you're. You're talking, but what you're the the concepts that you're pitching me are not supporting what you just said. What, what you just said, what you just said, sounds like you believe that this deity can protect. No, I never said that. 
No. You, you, you just asked him to please protect my, my family. I'm, I'm come sp- Again, I told you, it's a ritual. I'm speaking it into the world. I, this is what I want to manifest. I, I am totally under the impression that praying is just another version of a ritual where you're just speaking things into existence, bro. And when I talk to this esoteric fucking, you know, deity, that's a good way to put it. Yeah, I'm, I'm, it's, and again, I, I told you plenty of times tonight, I think we're all God. I think God is in all of us. I'm speaking right back to myself. I'm, I'm, I'm literally, <clears throat> whatever created us, yo, please protect us. Please protect my family. Please protect Landon. Please protect my brothers, my mother, everything. That That's honestly, it's all I ever pray for. Now as a grown man, it's all I ever pray for. I just want my family to, I, I want to. I want my family to outlast me. I don't want to die before these motherfuckers. I'll tell you what, I, I think that's a, a, a beautiful way to close down the, the, the podcast. Like, I want people to understand where your heart's at, you know, because I've never heard that come out of you, you know, and, 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 and I really haven't. And we've, we've, we've gone down, I don't know how many rabbit holes, you know, and, and to hear you say that like that, you know, that's dope because at the end of the day, it doesn't, mean, it doesn't matter what your belief is in regards to what controls what, your heart is... All about your family and making sure that they're good and and you're the last one on that list and I think that's dope you know that facts but listen hey older I get the more I realize family's the only fucking thing that matters bro. See, man I don't give like really this is. shit nothing yeah. nothing else matters bro I fucking I've, I've been through it traveling and family bro that's it hold right. back yeah you're right you're right and anyhow. Let's tell people what's up, man. What we got coming up? What, what's what's everybody watching, listening? So February fourteenth for Valentine's Hollow back at Casa Digi. Let them play as Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day. It's, well, it's, I think that's a fucking dope day to go Hell watch yeah. a comedian Hell yeah. challenge your relationship. <laughs> tell me you're gonna be ready, bro. Oh, him. To I'm just a, challenge every bit of the relationship. Hamilton. We're also getting the fucking uh, beer pong. And uh, speed dating. Ooh, what is that? Speed dating, bro. We're gonna start launching that. In I love in, it in uh, March. All right, so people gotta stay in tune. Remind everybody what your handle is on Instagram. The, on Instagram right now, currently it's the horse three hundred five. TikTok the same. So the li- li- literally the horse T H the horse three hundred five, and I think it might be underscore. B O C it. Um, I had to change it because they canceled a Gawaio. So, you know, I have to fucking oh, be creative and shit. <laughs> so uh, it, it's the horse three hundred five on social on uh, TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, also Kawaii. Bro, um, aside from that, like I said, I said the shows come February fourteenth. Oh yeah, I got speed dating. I got dominoes. I got beer pong. Hollow back. Follow me. Shout out to my dog Wesley. Fucking black sheep perspective. Que lo que hay. Love it. I bro. had a great time, G. Bro, I love you to death, man. Listen, you guys, show your love, show your respect, man. Go follow my brother. If you haven't already followed him, I'm imagining you guys already follow him, man. But if you didn't, tell some other people, man. I love this guy to death. I love when we catch up. It's been real, dog. We touched a lot of topics, and I love that we got deep, and I love Big that we challenged, we challenged each other, I'm you know? That, I'm glad that we, lo- we, we uh, lost was, track 15 yeah, times. Hell yeah. <laughs> well, that was a whole process. Yay! And I can't wait to have yeah. you back again, my brother. I love you to death, man. Love you, though. Big dog. Love you. Yo, check us out. Follow his shit. Follow mine. Merch. Everything. Let's do it.